You damn right. It's time to play the game. What is going on, everybody? It is your boy, Bad Dog. Yeah, welcome back, everybody. Glad I can be back. I don't miss the last three games. Uh, on vacation with the family, I told you, my wife and my son. Big birthday is this year. So we went away for a week. Uh, well, deserved vacation and much needed <laughs> vacation. Sometimes you just got to get away uh, from things. But that's where I was. Lakers went 2-1 and one when I was away. Um, I was, like I said, I was keeping up with the games. I actually was able to watch the Timberwolves game. Uh, did have NBA TV back at the hotel. And if it wasn't for Anthony Davis being injured, I do believe the Lakers could have beat the Timberwolves. The Lakers were right in that game until he went down. Obviously, no LeBron James. So that hurt the Lakers. It sucks that they lost that game because the Suns had also lost. Lakers still one and a half games out of sixth. The Kings are not doing, I shouldn't say the Kings, the uh, Thunder not doing the Lakers any favors. The Kings are killing them. There's a big game at the same time as this one as the Clippers take on the Suns. And the Lakers trying to get to the Suns and the Pelicans for six. The Lakers play the Pelicans the last game of the season on Sunday. So obviously that's huge. This game is also huge. Bad news for the Lakers. No Anthony Davis. He's out with a headache and nausea symptoms. So they're going to miss him huge. Good news, LeBron James is slated to play tonight. So obviously he's going to have to step up big. Hopefully he can play. He was out with flu-like symptoms against the Timberwolves on uh, what day was that? Sunday. So hopefully the Lakers can get this together. This is a massive, massive game. They have locked themselves into a play-in situation. The Rockets cannot catch them. So we will have at least one extra game. I'm hoping to have more than one extra game. You know I love doing these games. And the farther they go in the playoffs the more fun uh, we have for sure. Of course, big shout out to BetUS. Whoops. BetUS for sponsoring the channel as always. We love BetUS. Uh, make sure you click the link in the description. Get up to get your 125% match deposit bonus all the way up to $2,500 in bonus cash. That means if you click that link and enter the promo code join125 and you deposit $500 they're going to give you an extra $625 to play with for a total of $1,125. You really can't beat that. And like I said, you can do that three times. Take advantage of the best promotion going. It's BetUS. Also, they're giving away $125 for free. The first five people that DM me their account, you can do it on Instagram or Twitter. You DM me your account number. I send it to the good people at BetUS. They give you $25 for free. Nothing. You don't have to do anything. Terms and conditions apply, but make sure you do that. Just send me your, you don't need to send me your name. You don't need to send me your address. You don't need to send me not just your account number. I send to the good people about US. They credit your account with $25 for nothing, just for signing up. You can't beat that. Great customer service payouts within 24 hours. Make sure you do it. Click on BetUS. And as always, as I say, have fun. Please bet responsibly. We're going to bet responsibly right now. I haven't been able to bet in a few days. You guys know I love this over under points, rebounds. Uh, and assists, and for whatever reason, I don't see any Lakers here. I don't know why that is. Let's see if we can do this again. Where are we? Hopefully they change that, and I still don't see it. So I guess we're going to have to bet on some Warriors tonight. Well, let's see. Clay Thompson over 24 and a half. I kind of like that. We will do that. Uh, I don't know why there's no Lakers, but we will take Clay if we're going to – where did that go? Come on, Clay, get up there. We'll take the over on Clay. I always like taking the overs. I always love betting on Rui Hachimura. This is my favorite guy to bet on. I seem like I cash every time when we use Rui. So Clay's got to have over 25 points, rebounds, and assists. And obviously, I'm hoping I lose this bet because um, it would mean that he didn't have a good game, which is always a good thing. Is this going to work or are we just going to spin around? There we go. A little slow there, but let's get rid of that. And Trace Jackson Davis, uh, the odds have changed. Okay, let's click on this again. Um, I, I don't know what's going on here. That's working. That's working. You're not going to let me uh, get rid of this. All right, let's do this. I like him getting over 19 points, uh, 19 and a half points, rebounds, and assists. No Anthony Davis. I think Trace Jackson could have a double double pretty easily. I think that's pretty safe money. And again, just a little bit slow. This could be my computer. Uh, who knows? I haven't done this in a week, so just taking a little bit of time here. 
So we're, I'm just going to do a couple of these since this is running a little bit slow. And I want to get to my chat. I missed you guys. I missed you guys. Uh, did that? I don't even. Know, I don't even know if that went through or not. Uh, come on. What is getting on here? Get this going right now. Any day now. Ronnie Millsap saying that. So while I'm waiting on that, Asia, what's up? They can read remember for 49 months. Appreciate you. There we go. All right, there we go. So put a couple bets in there. Like I said, you guys can bet on this as well. You can bet on the spread. You can bet live betting. You can do whatever you want. There's so many prop bets you can play bet US. Um, why don't you, so we went to Disney World. I'll tell you a little story real quick. We went to Disney World. My kid is seven now. He turned seven. And <laughs> my kid is a daredevil. My kid loves roller coasters, uh, just crazy insane rides. He, he is a little bit crazy. Um, I hate roller coasters, okay? I am not afraid of a lot of things, but I have acrophobia. It means I am scared of heights. I do not like heights. So, you know, you can look at rides on YouTube and you can kind of see what they look like. So we go to Epcot and he's like, I want to go on Guardians of the Galaxy. So I look at Guardians of the Galaxy and I go, oh, it doesn't really, doesn't really look that bad. So you can't see anything. I'm just looking at the graphics on, it, like, I don't know if you've ever been on Guardians. It's, it's an incredible ride. So I'm just looking at the graphics. I'm like, well, it's not really, doesn't really look like it's going that fast. It's not a big deal. As soon as that ride starts, they throw you backwards and they start, sw I mean, it's just at a ridiculous speed. And you start, and I'm five seconds into that ride, I'm like, I'm going to shit in my pants. Like, I, I don't know what I got myself into. I have no idea what I'm on. What did I do to myself? And then about 10 seconds into it, 15 seconds into it, I absolutely loved it. So if anybody ever goes to Epcot and you've never been on Guardians of the Galaxy, go on that ride. It was unbelievable. And again, I'm not a roller coaster guy. I'm scared of roller coasters. But I was able to do that. And then I did a couple more on top of it at the other parks. So I conquered my fears somewhat. I still won't go on things that turn me upside down because I'll throw up. I just, I can't do that. I can become completely disoriented when I get turned upside down. So that's not going to happen. But... That was amazing. So I kind of conquered my fear. I, I just can't believe that I actually did that. And there's a picture, you know, when you start going, anybody that's been on a roller coaster, you do that drop. They usually have a camera there to get your reaction to the drop. So on our picture, my kid has his eyes closed like this. My wife's hair is in her face because you're going so fast. And I'm either laughing or smiling. And I think I'm just laughing because I'm sitting there going, I can't believe I'm actually doing this and I'm actually enjoying it. So I think I was laughing a little bit crazy. 378 people in the house. Hit the thumbs up, subscribing the bell. Did you guys miss me? I missed you. I missed you. And I am ready for some damn Laker basketball. I am ready for Laker basketball. Without question. I missed you guys. I'm ready to rock and roll. We're not missing another game the rest of the year. Hopefully, the Lakers can get to the finals against the Knicks. That would be the greatest thing ever. I would love it. Uh, Bluegrass, thank you, bro. He says, Warriors, come out and play. Lakers got to win this game, guys. This game is so huge. Obviously, they're in the play-in, but they want it. At it, 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 the worst, they want to be ninth so that they have their first home game, which would be against the Warriors. At the best, they could get to sixth. They'd have to win every game. They can't afford to lose one. Now, this is a winnable game. The Warriors are not a great team. They miss Anthony Davis, which sucks. They play the Grizzlies on Friday. So that's a winnable. They should beat the Grizzlies. And then the huge game against the Pelicans, which could mean sixth. Uh, we need some help, though. We need the Suns to lose. We need the Clippers. Lakers fans, you got to root for the Clippers tonight. You know, they say politics make strange bedfellows. So do the playoffs. Laker fans, you have got to root for the Clippers tonight. Need the Clippers to beat the Suns. And I, I, the Pelicans are playing the Blazers. I don't expect the Blazers to win. They've packed it in. As as our, guy, as our girl Gwendolyn says, 3-2-1 Cancun. That's kind of where they are. So don't expect an upset there. 
um, which sucks. It would be nice if the Suns and Blazers lost. Like I said, the Thunder not doing the Lakers any favors. The Kings are blowing them out, so they're not going to be able to catch the Kings tonight either. Lakers are just like a half game out of seventh. I mean, it's really close between sixth and ninth in the West. It, it could go anyway. Xavier, my man, thank you for being a member for 10 months, brother. Appreciate it. How can I be the man when you demand, brother? Who else do we got in here? Jay Ober Gaming, Adam Cotillo. You're keeping that thumbs up. You know we love to get these likes up before the tip off. We want at least 300, maybe 400 games on TNT tonight. I'm ready to go. I got up very early this morning to catch my flight. So. Um, you'd think I'd be a little jet lag. Don't worry about it. I took a nice nap at about five o'clock. Woke we'll about six thirty, so we're good to go. Have no fear. Coke Zero's here. We're good to go. We're good to go. Let's open this baby up. Let's crack over to Coke Zero. Room temperature soda is great. Uh, Aaron Willie, what up? How gonna be the man when you the man? Uh, where are we? Jordan, Joe, Bernardo, DeBears TV, Muto Growl, Kyra Commander, Mutz, what up, Brandon Fields, how you doing, Steven Amaro, how can I be the man, we need a man, buddy, Muhammad Haroud, what up, buddy, Micker, what's up, 24K, what's up, thank you, he says you seem dope, hey, listen to me, have you never been to one of these uh, streams before, like and subscribe, man, I'm telling you right now, you're gonna, not going to find a stream worth more energy than me, you can't, they would spontaneously sing about us, trust me, I tell you, there's nobody with more energy than me. I'm a little bit crazy. I'm a little bit wired. I have my own little cliche catchphrases. They're kind of corny, but they're funny. We're good. We have a lot of fun in this chat. No question about it. Love you guys and girls being here. Mark Don and you know what's going on. KP, my man. How are you? Justine Severo. I can't believe my kid's seven years old, man. It's insane. You guys and girls have been with me for a while. Remember when I would stream from my casting couch and my kid was in a diaper and can barely walk. And now he's seven and riding roller coasters. It is crazy. He was very disappointed. We went to we went to Universal yesterday, and he was very disappointed he couldn't ride the Hulk because you have to be fifty four inches, and he's forty nine. And uh, I, I'm like, I, I I I look at that ride and I get sick. He also wanted to go on the Veloci the Veloci coaster, but you had to be fifty one inches. So he just missed. I said next year we go again. Um, You'll probably be able to ride the Velocicoaster, maybe even the Hulk ride if he goes five inches in a year, which is very possible. My kid's insane. But it's crazy how it goes. We went on the Harry Potter ride. I knew he would love that. The Spider-Man ride was all... We had a really good time. It was really good. Um, I didn't worry about my diet for a few days. Needless to say, my brain was happy. Uh, my body was not. My body was like, what are you putting into me? Oh, man, I, I ate like a human being. I had like... Uh, I had danishes and I had some beer and I had filet mignon and I had spaghetti and meatballs and a couple of cannolis and yeah, I had some cookies from Gideon's Bakehouse, which you've never been to Gideon's, my God. Yeah, so I like lived it up for a few days and um, today I've had about 900 calories and back to reality because I'm like, nah, I really got, I got to cut all those calories back. So about 500, 600 calories a day that I normally eat, I got to take off my diet. So that's going to be fun. Johnny, my man, thank you for being a, thank you for being a member. Thank you for the super chat, brother. Thank you for being a Turn off. He says, Stella, you will have a good... Stella! Bad dog, you'll have a good football year. Fangio, uh, Morris, Ronnie, stink. And they want Hurts to be a pure pass. They're not going to happen. You the man. I'm going to be the man. You the man. It'll be interesting to see what happens, Johnny. I'm looking forward to the draft. I can tell you that right now. Hit that thumbs up, guys. Girls, let's get these likes over here. Got almost 500 people in here already. Again, the game's on TNT. Smack, like, hit, subscribe, ring bell. Share the stream on Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, Discord, TikTok, Reddit. No one what's going on. Thank you for being here. Unknown person, Mickey X, Nicholas, Gio Agaka. I can't even say that. Are you serious? The Kings and Thunder are tied, dude? Hold on a second. Hold on a second. It was 65 to 54. It's wow, it's 80 to 74 right now. But that game is a blowout. It's 80 to 74. Unless that changed. Uh, it's 83 to 74 now, but that's much better than 29 or 21, whatever it was. Um Biker, what up? Tim Costigan, Nicholas Mathis, thank you for being here. Sharon Marie, my lady, thank you for being here. Steve Abrimsky, Joseph Ochoa, John Regidor, Mel Guerrero. Thank you for being here. Sahil 2K, uh, Asmando Bortaman Jr., Amzi, 
What up, Jenny, uh, Janu, Vicky de Guzman, Kenneth, what's going on, Adam Hurley, Tenzin, Naima, Arlo Tate, what's going on, thank you for being here, Bluegrass, thank you, bro, appreciate you, really, really, he says, Harry Potter thing, a universe, really, it is, it is a lot of fun, I knew my kid would like that, I remembered, I didn't remember a lot of, uni- I've only been to universe once before this, and it was like 11 years ago, so I didn't remember, but I remembered that ride. And I remember the Hulk, right? Because I remember looking at it going, I don't know. I don't know if Spider-Man was there or not. We went on the con. We got, we got very lucky. We didn't have to wait in line long for anything. Um, not at all. We Magic King, like we got through the line pretty quick, which is pretty awesome. But like I went, we went to MGM Studios or Hollywood Studios and I went on the, the Slinky Dog roller coaster. Like this is stuff I would never do. Like, the drop, it's not a massive drop, but like, I'm scared of that. I went on the Jurassic Park ride. It was a major drop. Uh, it was a water ride, a major drop. Now, my wife's always like, are you okay? Because <laughs> I don't like that. But I guess for your kid, you'll do almost anything, okay? You'll do almost anything for your kid. Like I said, I ain't going on a damn Hulk ride. You, you couldn't get me to, you couldn't pay me enough to go on. There's some things you couldn't pay me enough to go on. But the fact that I went on four roller coasters, you know, is insane because I don't like them. And Guardians of the Galaxy, like I said, I got on that thing. I thought I was going to die when it first happened. I'm like, I'm I'm in so much. I remember thinking to myself when I was on there, I'm like, please just don't turn me upside down. But I should know better. If you don't have, so I, I think I, I found something out about the height requirements for these rides. If you have a shoulder harness, which you do on Harry Potter, you're pretty much going to get turned upside down. Now, Harry Potter, you don't really get turned upside down. You kind of get bent back, but you're not completely upside down. So when I was on Guardians of the Galaxy, I didn't know it, but it's a bar that goes across. So, so you're not going to go upside down unless you have shoulder harnesses. That that's And that's why you have to be taller because you got to make sure you fit in those shoulder harnesses. So I should have known then, but even when I was on that ride, I'm like, oh my God, don't turn me upside down. I'm gonna, I'll throw up. So that was awesome though. I, I loved it, man. I was screaming. I was like, woo, that's good. I loved it by the end of it. It was amazing. It was exhilarating uh, for sure. Sam, what up? Yes, LeBron is playing tonight. Yes, he is. No Anthony Davis, but LeBron is here. Sam, what up? Uh, Mike, the LA Dons fan, Mr. Joshua. R squared. Thank you, bro. What up, man? Doug was worried about you. Good to see you. I texted you. I told you in the DM. I said I was in sunny Florida. The day I left, we got snow here in the Northeast. We got like two to four inches of snow. I didn't miss any of that. I was down in sunny Florida, 75, 77 degrees, perfect weather. It actually got cold at night. Like, I was actually cold. I was like, I should be bringing hoodies into the park, but I don't want to carry them around. But, uh, Kevin Kerr, what up? Mark Don and Bingo, Jen Nagels, Albert Jerez. Yeah, Hoochie Mama! They're going to need him to step up big tonight. Tenzin from Edmonton. Uh, yes, the town is awesome. It, it, Disney's a lot of fun. I'm a, I'm a, I always tell you guys, I'm a big kid, so I, I love it. I didn't get to go there as a kid. As an adult, like I said, you want to do you want to do things for your kids that you weren't able to do as a kid. So, you know, the fact that we can take him there and he can have a good time is always fun. But he's seven, so, you know, sometimes he gets a little bit whiny about the long lines. And I try to tell him, because I tell him all the time. I, I mean, I don't throw a fit. Like, he's seven, so, he, you know, he's <sighs> And I try to tell him, like, listen, buddy, daddy don't like waiting in these lines either. I'm impatient just like you. I don't like it, but I can't do anything about it. Um, so someday he gets in his he gets in his moods, and then he doesn't want to eat anything, and then he gets cranky, and then once he eats, he's good. So it's just try it's hard to slow him down. Like, buddy, you gotta take a break. You just gotta take a second. Why are all these people here? Why are they, I said because they want to go on the ride just like you do. So you gotta wait for people to get off the ride. Um, Levi Hernandez, Mubakar Zito, what up? Michi Lok, big moo! Hey, we'll do the show on Thursday, brother. Show on Thursday. And the draft a week from Thursday, big moo, which I can't wait. Cassie Losi, my lady, how you doing? I missed you guys and girls too. Yes, I did. We got to get these likes up here, though. Got to get the likes up. Got to get them. 540 in here, 208 likes. We got to do better. We can do better. Michi Lok, Dashi, what up? You're in Delray Beach. Yeah, I was in Disney. Uh, I was in Disney. We flew out Wednesday morning, got back this morning. Cole Noel, what up? Uh, Clean Frame, how you doing? Betty K to Real, Uncle Pizzle at 2.47 in the morning, which tells me you guys set your clocks ahead an hour. Aldrich, Calapon, Cole Noel, Rondo TV, Gubby, Gilpilly, Ray Soto. 
It was sunny Florida. Yeah, sunny, sunny Florida. Sunny Florida. It was beautiful down there. First night we came in, actually, we were delayed at the airport for like an hour at our end, flying out of upstate New York because the weather down in Florida was rough. They had thunderstorms the day we flew in. We had a small window. They were telling you, get on the plane, get your shit in there, and let's go. Um, because obviously, we had a small window. People did. We got down there. Uh, anyway, it did thunder a little bit, but that was fine. The first day we were at Disney Springs because we didn't go to a park the first day, so that was fine. You can go into shops and do whatever you want to do at that point. Um, Devontae, Larry, Arvin, Nora. Thank you for being here. Cody, Nethercat, what up? Dwan Bryant, Big Moo. Oh, yes, all three days, Big Moo. All three days. Give you a couple of coins for that. Uh, yes, all three days, Chris and I will be live for that draft. First, the way we always do it, first night on my channel, day two and three on his channel. Looking forward to seeing what the Giants do. Without question, please don't take J.J. McCarthy. I can tell you this, that was one thing I was able to get away from is all the football stuff. Like, I was pretty much, I think KP said it, sometimes you got to get away from the internet. And I would check, you know, once in a while, I would just check YouTube just to see if anybody put a video out that I wanted to watch or there was any comments. or. But I didn't look like, I looked at the Lakers score, but I didn't see any Giants news. I, I looked at the Yankees score. I listened to some Yankee games because I have the app so I can listen to baseball anytime. So I remember shopping. My kid and I were listening to the Yankees and Diamondbacks game that went into extra innings. Uh, and they ended up winning that. So that was good. It was the first day there. Um, they can't win without AD. Well, they're two and three without Anthony Davis. Hopefully they can. It does suck that they don't have him tonight, but at least LeBron James is playing. Can I do a shout out for your son, Riker? Yes. Hello, Riker. Happy birthday, buddy. Everybody in this chat wish Cassie's son, Riker, a happy fourth birthday. He's getting old. He's getting older now. He's getting to get, you know, you have, you have other children. So for they start to become a little bit more independent. They can do their own thing. You ain't got to be a helicopter parent like I was my kid. Uh, but yes, happy birthday, Riker. Uh, Jesse Ampa Funk Dungeon. What up? A guy from Rockford, Illinois. Jay Roast, Edgar Williams. Thank you for being here. Forrest Breeze, thank you for that thumbs up. Cole, thank you for your first ever super chat. They tell me you never forget your first. Hello, buddy. Love your streams. Thank you, Cole. Appreciate you, buddy. Appreciate you. LeBron, what up? He says AD is soft. AD has missed five games this year, man. How can you How can you call a guy soft? A guy got knocked in the eye. He's nauseous and has a headache. He, luckily, he doesn't have a concussion. Um, I'm not going to say Anthony Davis is soft for missing six games this year. He's been the best player on this team all year, and they really need him. Um, so... Uh, Big Moo! Thank you, buddy. Appreciate you. Thank you for being 24-hour stream, June 22nd, my man. It'll be here before you know it, but the 24-hour stream should be good. Yes, we're... Um, I did write that down. I thought I wrote... The, yes. So the charity that we're doing that for, I told you we're going to do something for mental health awareness. National Alliance of Mental Illness, NAMI, for short N-A-M-I. That will be the charity... Um, that we do the 24-hour stream for in June. It'll be the first day of summer, second day of summer, so it's the longest day of the year. So I got about 15 hours of daylight, nine hours of darkness. So I should be able to get through that pretty good. Louis T will be on. I'm sure we'll talk about. I'm sure we'll talk about some wrestling at three o'clock in the morning. But I'm sure I get Patty. You know, Chris should be on. I'll get Patty Train on again. I know she had a good time oh, when she was on the stream. Louis T. I'll see if I can get more people. Um. I would like to have Tom Grassi back on again. Trevor from Lakers Nation, they were on the last time. I'd like to see if I can get some more guests. Um, so, it's pretty cool. Uh, Amari Kabazuda, what's going on? Boy, Alan Mandahar. What up? Hey, I love seeing all the happy birthdays in the chat. There you go. Rolando Petito. VJ FX, Wreck Baby, Marco Dane. Thank you for being here, everybody. Appreciate you. Gus Gafu. Yes, the Yankees won again. 10 and 2, best team of baseball, as I tell my kid. See, my kid's starting to get into the Yankees, which I love. I love. Um, and he was watching the Laker game with me uh, in the hotel room. So he every time that he would look at that, like, he, he doesn't sit there and like stare at it because he's seven and he's, you know, all over the place. Um, but he's like, the Lakers are winning, Dad. Like, and I'm like, yes, but that can that can change. So he's like, the Lakers are winning, the Lakers are winning. Yes, they are. It was good. Um, 
But thank you for being here, Gus. Angel, what up? Carlos Blanco. Uh, no habla espanol, my friend. No habla espanol. But uh, gracias. Appreciate you being here, man. Uh, Austin, my man. It's just ironic. It's perfect that his name is Austin Carter, right? Austin. Uh, huge game for both teams. A big implications. Thank you, Austin. Appreciate it. You know why it's amazing? Because you know the $10 Super Chat gets one of these. Stone Cold Steve Austin. Give me a hell yeah. That's the only thing my kids really... I was playing a lot of Stone Cold videos, and we were, like, waiting for dinner. We had reservations, but we were, like, waiting. You get there a little bit early, wait. I was showing him, like, Stone Cold stuff, and he was loving it because it's my favorite wrestler. But he's all into... He's into the female wrestlers. Like, he likes the girls. He doesn't really care about the guys. He just likes the girls. And he likes the, he likes the Royal Rumble because they're all in the ring at the same time. Um... Uh, Equi 8, what's going on? Marcial Pocot, David Sabington, Jakari Jones, appreciate y'all being here. No, LeBron is in tonight, David, but no Anthony Davis. We got 250 likes, guys and girls. Come on, we got to get 300 likes. I was actually on here early tonight, so we got to get these likes up here. We usually get 300, 400 likes for this tip off. I know we can get 300 likes. I know. And now the game's on TNT, so you know the tip off says 10 o'clock. You know it's actually 10 10. Um, just to tell you, the Lakers are actually a two and a half point favorite at the beginning of the day. And when Anthony Davis was announced that he was out, you see the Golden State Warriors are now a one and a half point favorite. This is the Lakers regular home season finale. So unless they win some games in the play in round, well, I mean, if they're ninth, they'll have another home game, but they, uh, if they end up 10th, they will not, unless they win two games to get into the playoffs. Lakers, listen, Lakers are playing really good basketball. They, if if Anthony Davis and LeBron James were both healthy, even if Anthony Davis had played that whole game against Minnesota, I feel like the Lakers could have beat them. Okay, Lakers are playing really good basketball. It just sucks that Anthony Davis isn't playing tonight, and it sucks that LeBron James missed the last game. It just sucks that they're injured now. Like they need these games. They can't lose another game. They finish up 48 wins. It's very possible they get to six. At the very least, they're going to get to eighth. I would imagine. So. Uh, let's go, man. Ken James and up. Jake Cassidy, Edzel Sapico, Jacob Nagel, Perry Butler are going to be the man. We need a man, buddy. Gregory Hill, Angel, what's going on? Thank you for being here. Listen, man, he got hit in the eye. I don't know what his deal is. Okay? It's not because Anthony Davis didn't want to play. Um, I don't know. I'm sure he wanted to play. He's not playing tonight for the same reason. He got hit in that eye earlier this year. And I, what I want to know is, how's a dude get whacked in the face and there's no foul? There was no foul on that play. On a putback dunk, the dude got wrecked in the face and no foul. Tell me how. Uh, next phase, thank you, bro. Appreciate you, man. Thank you for being a friend. He says, glad your boy likes the girl. Yes, he does. He likes them a lot. The longer the hair, the better. Um, like when we go to Disney... My kid, he likes Mickey. I mean, who doesn't? I, I like Donald Duck. Like Donald Duck and Goofy are my guys, right? I want to see Donald Duck. And I also love Gaston, who's never around anymore. But Gaston has always won because, you know, he's a guy that lifts weights and Gaston's fun. He's my favorite villain. Um, we had dinner with uh, the dwarfs, which was fun. My wife calls me Grumpy. So Grumpy was there. Dopey was there. But <coughs> my kid likes Rapunzel. He likes Ariel. He likes the... <laughs> likes the princesses daddy where are the girls <laughs> daddy where are the girls so yes he, he definitely likes girls uh, without question um he says disappointing we don't have ad but let's go lakers tip your bad dog people it's not bad advice it's not bad advice but thank you next phase i appreciate it and yes it does suck hopefully the lakers can pull us one out man Teodoro Jr., what up? Klaxo, what up? Gregory Hill, easily fix services from Dan Under. Thank you for watching. Always appreciate that, mate. Have you have a great day. We go to get these likes up here. That was another thing. When you're in Disney World, you hear people that you know they come from all over the world. I heard so many different accents. Definitely had a couple of Aussies down there. A lot of British people go to uh, Disney. A lot of, especially in the Harry Potter section. Um, but a lot of, I heard a lot of people, you could hear the Irish accent. It's so cool. It's so cool. Like, it's kind of like this stream. People come from all over the world to go to Disney. Um, I just think that's the coolest thing ever. Just to see people from different, you know, countries and cultures. And so it, I, for me, it's very interesting. Kelly Roberts, what's going on? Dwayne Washington, how are you doing? 
I did not see Nas Reed got ejected against the Clippers. What I or the Wizards. What I do know is Nas Reed kills the Lakers. Kills the Lakers. Especially when Davis went out. Abrax's voice. What up, Ryan Romero? Any predictions for tonight? Yes, the Lakers win in an upset. Yes. <laughs> LeBron drops 30. Flu game for LeBron tonight. <laughs> Narco, what up? Tiana Scott, my lady. Good for you. Yes, I was uh, in Disney World on uh, for a week. I just got back this morning. So I was out. I was on vacation. Sometimes you need to get away from things, and that's what we did. My wife and son's birthday passed during the last week, so we you know, go down to Disney for that. Um, my wife loves Disney and my kid loves Disney and hey, I love Disney too. So, you know, we took a trip down there. That's the only vacation we take. I don't go anywhere else. We go to Lake George for a night, but that's about it. We don't take a lot. Of, we don't travel a lot. That's like our one, one time a year we actually go someplace. Um, but it's nice. You got to get away from stuff, man. I love doing these Laker games. I certainly miss doing the Laker games, uh, without question, um, if we had like a different type of hotel room where it wasn't just one room or two beds and it had, it was like more like a suite, like the last time I stayed there because my wife's aunt has a timeshare and it's like a villa. If I had that type of setup and their bedroom is at a different spot in the, in the, uh, you know, in the apartment or whatever, I would have done it on my phone cause I had it. So I would, I would have definitely done it on my phone, but, uh, because they're right next to me. I can't be going, Swiss cheese! I can't do that. I'd be waking them up. Alexander's channel, what up? Thank you, we there. Kelly Roberts, Keith Johnson, Brianna, what's going on? We're going to do the Yankees tomorrow. I did a Yankee game Tuesday, the day before I left. But I'm going to do the Yankees tomorrow. So we'll do another Yankee game tomorrow. I'll be live with Chris on Thursday. We'll do the Lakers on Friday. Um, I don't know what Saturday brings. It might just be a day off. And then Sunday we'll do the Lakers again, regular season finale. And obviously plans begin April 16th through the 19th. So we'll be live for those. And hopefully it's just one play-in game and a win for the Lakers. They get into the playoffs and then we can have at least a few more games together. Hopefully the Lakers can make a nice run at it again and we can have a lot of games together. Carolyn King with up 289 likes again close. Smack the like, hit the subscribe button, ring the ding, ring a ding, 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 ding the bell. Where are we at for subscribers anyway? We we can get to let's see where we're at. We are at 134.59. So let's have a massive stream. Let's reach to the stars. Let's get to 134,200 subscribers tonight. You can't do you can't subscribe to anything for free. You can subscribe to this channel. It does not cost you a dime. How many things can you get a subscription to that are free? You get that here. You get the best looking co-host, you know, on YouTube. You get the most excitable, energetic guy on YouTube. And most, most importantly, you get the best chat on YouTube. The best. I have the best chat. There's no question about it. No question about it. And I have the best mods. If there's any asshole in here that's trying to ruin the chat, don't worry. My mods will take care of them. They're the best in the business. That's why you want to subscribe. Don't cost nothing. 308 likes. Love to see you keep banging. You know, oh, you know what I didn't do tonight? Oh, my God. You can tell I've been out of it. You can tell I've been out of it. Can we get 1,000 likes? You know I forgot to do it. There we go. There we go. Um, Francine Jean, Vincent Trang, Kurt Slick, Evangelis, uh, 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 I'm sorry. Uh, Ellie Angelis Silva, easy for me to say. Thank you, reader. Demontiac, Pinkney, Melvin McGee, Sean Francis, OZ Beer, Void. I've been on vacation. I was on vacation for the last week. Just got back this morning. Lulu Conti, HTTR Carson, Zion Kalam, Paul Reed. Did you guys miss me? Let me see. If you missed me, throw a one in the chat. If you said, I needed a break from your stupid ass, put a two in the chat. I can take it. Uh, <laughs> Van Udom, what's going on? Cairo Kid, what up? Thank you for being here. Appreciate it. Demarcus Johnson, how we doing? Everybody, there's the ones. I love to see it. I missed you guys too. I missed you too. Trust me when I tell you. I missed you too. But we're back. We ain't missing another game. We ain't missing another game, baby. We bringing it. Britain Ayers are going to be the man when you the man. Let's go. You guys are way too kind. I appreciate you. I know person says he didn't need to be here. Austin, man. Thank you. In your 20th. Super Chat is a massive 
50 bomb. Thank you so much, Austin. I appreciate you. He says, I missed you. And come on, smash the like button. Smash it. And Austin, thank you, bro. Thank you very much. That's really nice. Thank you. Thank you, buddy. Everybody wants a Trump voice, right? Everybody wants a Trump dog. You want to donate 50 bucks, you get the Trump drop. That's the way that goes. But Austin, man, thank you, bro. Really appreciate that. Thank you so much. Um, but Mimic Major up, Daryl Rayner, how we doing? And my co-host, yes. <laughs> if you missed my co-host, put a one in there <laughs> as well. Carl Mislos, I'm doing well. Hope you're doing well too. Marvin, Salamana, Manga, 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 all my Filipino brothers out there. Let's get 400 likes. 400 likes. We're 53 away. 831 people in here. Laker girls are on the court. Smack that like button. Hit the subscribe, ring the bell. This is the biggest game of the season for the Lakers so far. Huge game. Got to win. No Anthony Davis. You take a look at that. Lakers are a half game behind the Kings. Kings look like they're going to win. They're one and a half games behind the Suns and the Pelicans. The Suns play the Clippers tonight. The Pelicans play the Blazers. We need a miracle with the Blazers. Suns could lose. Lakers play the Pelicans the last game of the season. That could mean six. The Lakers can't lose another game. They've got to find a way to win this game. Hit that thumbs up. You want the Lakers to win this game. Let's go. Yeah, load management. It's vacation. As Gwendolyn would say, 3-2-1 Disney for me, not Cancun. Um, Where are we? Irish, my man. Good to see you, buddy. Thank you, Brianna. Love you guys and girls too, without question. Jimmy Jamie, what up, Marming? Salamana Manga Danga Manga. Is Jimmy Jaime? Appreciate you being here. T Lava Money Marlow, how can I be the man to demand? Dwayne Johnson says hit the like button. Yes, great advice. Kelly Gardner, uh, Tyler Miles, Cedric Alexander. Appreciate you guys and girls being here. Thanks so much. Edgar Boromio, Marming, Salamana Manga Danga Manga. Thank you for being here. 36 away. Come on, guys and girls. Hit that thumbs up. Smack that thing. Draymond Green, that like button. There is LeBron James. He's going to go tonight. Let's go. Ram Channel, Del Griffith. Yeah, don't worry, Del. We're back, baby. We're back. We're back and ready to go. 360, 370 likes. Getting ready to tip off. D'Lo, Reeves, Rui, LeBron, Jackson, Hayes for your Lakers. The Warriors have Curry, Clay, Wiggins, Draymond, Trace, Jackson, Davis. Let's hope that... Uh, Steph Curry has uh, the bubble guts and has to go to the locker room. Lakers win the tip. And here we go, guys and girls. Keep hitting that thumbs up, subscribe, ring a ding, ding a ding, ding the bell. Let's go, Lakers. They need this one. If you're just tuning in, Noel Anthony Davis with LeBron James here. Jackson Hayes kicks it out to LeBron over to D'Lo. D'Lo for three, and that one's not even close. Rebound by Draymond. I'll give it off to Steph. And they we're just underway. Big game between the Warriors and the Lakers. Ninth and 10th in the West. Both of these teams will be in the play-in. Both of these teams would like to get out of the ninth and 10th. At least get to that 8th spot. So you just got to get in and win one game. Curry's floater is good. He got the lucky bounce. 2 to nothing. That shot wasn't even close. But he got a very friendly bounce. 2 nothing. Golden State. D'Lo going to give it off to LeBron. Swings it out to Austin Reeves. Reeves goes around a screen, double team in the corner. Got free somehow, goes up and missed everything. Looked like a Russell Westbrook layup as he bounced it off the glass and got no rim. Draymond has the top of the circle. They had a bad pass. Good defense there by Jackson Hayes. Comes away with the steal. Gives it off to LeBron James. LeBron has it at the top of the key. LeBron looking to back down. Clay Thompson now gives it off to Rui at the top of the circle. Gives it back to LeBron James, top of the key. LeBron James with the basketball, looks to make a move, jab step, pulls up, and he doesn't get it to go. Lakers over the first three, rebound by Trace Jackson. Here comes Steph Curry, but they just totally carried the basketball. They don't care about that. The game went off here to Clay, way off balance shot. That one wasn't good, and the ball goes out of bounds. Last touch by Trace Jackson, and it'll be, is it Trace? Trace Davis, I should say. I hate the hyphenated names. Keep in that thumbs up, guys. Goes, Come on, baby. 391, don't stop, get it, get it. L.A. Lou, my man, what up? Good to see my guy, L.A. Lou, in the house. Missed the last couple streams, buddy. Of course, I haven't streamed in a week either. Here's D'Lo down the lane, goes up and throws up an air ball. Lakers over the first four. Back comes Clay Thompson the other way. Clay gives it off there. Clay gets it back in the corner. Clay gives it out to Draymond. They give him the three. He'll take it. He'll make it. It's 5 nothing. Golden State. Listen, you know, let Draymond shoot threes all night long. The guy ain't going to make many of those, so if he makes one, he makes one. Just give it to him. LeBron over to Rui. Rui gives it back to D'Lo. D'Lo over to LeBron James. LeBron calls out for a screen. Rui sets the screen. LeBron finds Rui. Gives it off to Hayes, who goes up. Missed everything. Again, the Lakers are 0 for 6. Here comes 
Uh, down the lane goes Trace Jackson. Blocked by Jackson Hayes. I'm surprised it wasn't a foul call. Rui comes back the other way. Rui out to Reeves. Reeves for three. Swiss cheese sandwich, Austin. Three. 5-3, Golden State. 9-25 to go in the first. Clay Thompson with the basketball around a screen. Drives down the lane. And the ball is stolen away. Almost stolen away by Jackson Hayes. But it went off of him last and out of bounds. It'll be Golden State basketball. Let's go, guys, girls. Good to see you, my guy. L.A. Lou, Sheldon Oaks, Mario S. Thank you for being here, guys. Raymond Falks. Appreciate you being here, everybody. Rebirth to Castro. My guy, Boto the Goto. That shot is no good. That was halfway down and out for Clay. Rebound by Rui. He'll give it off to LeBron James. He brings it into the front court for the Lake Show. Drives around a screen. Looks to back down Andrew Wiggins on the low post. LeBron backs him down. LeBron in the blocks. LeBron spins, fades, turns, and he tickles the twine. LeBron's first field goal ties the game at five. Just over three minutes gone by in the first. Steph will bring it up here for Golden State. Curry with the basketball goes around a screen. Throws it out to Draymond. He'll take another three. You got to be fucking kidding me, man. Draymond Green, two for two from downtown. Come on, man. That's a bunch of crap. You know he can't shoot. That's garbage. Let him shoot it all night. Eight to five. Lakers down by three. Here's Austin Reeves in the paint. Finds Hayes. Hayes goes up with a two-handed. Boom! Shock a lot of nice time there by Reeves. Eight to seven. Golden State by one. Here's Curry. Wiggins in the basket. Pulls up from 17 feet away. Rims out on him. Rebound by D'Lo. D'Lo starts up. Gives it off to LeBron. Brings it into the front court. LeBron has it in the free throw line. Backing down Clay. Fades away. Fires and he tickles the twine. LeBron making his last couple of buckets. 9-8. to eight. Lakers lead by one. Eight minutes to go in the first quarter. Here comes Steph Curry up the court. Goes around a screen by Trace Davis. Splits defenders. Gets into the paint. Throws up a wild shot. No good. Tip no good. Rebound grabbed by Rui. Rui on the run down the right side of the court. Finds LeBron. LeBron into the paint. Kicks out to D'Lo. D'Lo tried to save it. A bad pass. He stepped out of bounds. It's a turnover for the Lakers. Hit that thumbs up. Hopefully not, Red Mask. Hopefully not. Hopefully they can find a way to win, man. Why BZ? LeBron is playing. Anthony Davis is not. Mark Joseph, Dionis, Jose Meda. There's my guy, Bodo. Love my guy, Bodo. Master Eden, what up? MC, MC. MC squared, I guess, what that is. Here's uh, another three. Jesus. The Warriors not missing their threes early on. As Clay knocks that one down. 11-9. Golden State. Dilo with a basketball. Tries to drive on Wiggins, throws it out. Rui steps into a three, leaves it short. Rebound goes right to Steph Curry. He brings it up into the front court for the Warriors around a screen. Curry drives along the baseline. Kicks it out to Draymond, who the mustard's off the hot dog. Draymond threw a fastball, and Curry was expecting a changeup. Then it goes out of bounds. 425 likes, love to see it. How many likes can we get by the end of this first quarter, baby? Hit that thumbs up, subscribe, ring the bell. This game is so big for the Lakers. I can't understate or overstate how important this is. Corner three for Rui and a swish cheese sandwich. Hoochie mama! 12 to 11 in LA. Draymond throws it outside there to Clay. In the lane, down the lane. Clay with a strong drive. 13 to 12. That's where the Lakers really miss Anthony Davis's presence, especially down low in the paint on both sides of the court. Reeves around a screen, drives into a double team, goes along the baseline, throws it out to LeBron, who almost turned it over. Rui gets the basketball back. Rui pulls up from the elbow. It's too strong. Rebound grabbed by Jackson Hayes, goes up, and Jackson Hayes is fouled. LeBron hanging on the rim so he don't get hurt. And we'll have our first TV timeout of the night. 626 to go in the first quarter. A good game so far. 13-12 Golden State. How many likes can we get during the commercial break? Can we get the 500 likes? Can we get 60 more? Hit that thumbs up while I say hello to people in the chat. Uh, Van Chica, what's going on? Pearson Durant, how are we doing? Uh, Ronell Blyden, what up? There's a CeeLo, a D-Lo, and an ELO, right? Evil woman! Right, Bodo? Jabari, uh, Eberita Vargas, what's going on? Brian Ree, Jin Sua, what is up? Dennis Malay, Nicholas C, yes, we are a week from Thursday. Chris and I will be live on this channel, night one, his channel, days two and three. Looking forward to seeing what the Giants are doing. I'm getting a little bit nervous now. We are getting close. 
Steve Abramski, what's going on, my man? Cheyenne and Shani, Maraming Salamana Mangadanga Manga to you at 10.13 in the morning Wednesday in the Philippines. Mariah Johnson, what up? How we doing? Greg Lorraine, my cravings. You've been on Lakers. I hope you win, buddy. I hope you win. Kendrick Reddick, what up? Giancarlo Ibonis, Maraming Salamana Mangadanga Manga, my friend. Tyrone Bastion from the Bahamas. We know it, baby. Alan Morales, what up? Uh, the draft starts April 25th, a week from Thursday. Yes, that is the final chance to do mock drafts. And I'm sure there's plenty of mock drafts. I haven't even done one. Haven't done one. Have not done one. Highlights, what up? Big Joe! Thank you for the thumbs up, Big Joe. Appreciate you, man. Yeah, 468, 470. We're closing in on it. We got 30 likes so far in this commercial break. Levi Hoagland, what up? Uh, thank you for being here. Anthony Edwards, 47 points. Damn. Uh, the Ant-Man going off. Mohammed El Nori, what up? Cornell Willie, how we doing, buddy? Thank you for being here. Appreciate you. 475 of the likes. We're getting close to that 500 mark. Now the Kings and Thunder are tied at 102. 350 to go in the fourth quarter. Obviously, that's very important for the Lakers. They need the Thunder to pull this one out. With a Kings loss and a Laker win, the Laker would move. The Lakers would move into eighth, and that's obviously huge. And then hopefully the Suns lose, and the Lakers would be one half game out of seventh. Somehow you would need the Pelicans to lose. I don't think the Blazers are going to beat them. The Lakers play the Pelicans on the last game of the season. Hopefully the Lakers are like within a game and they can catch them. That would be great. My guy, Dyer Giants fan, what up, buddy? Thank you for being here. The Kings are up now, up one hundred five to one hundred four. We're going to keep an eye on that. As that's getting close. Good to see you, my man. Look at all my mods. I love to see it. Roderick Dyer Giants. And my lady, Janice is in the house. Boda winner, LA Lou, Irish Rover, Dashy. I love to see my guys in blue and my guys and girls in the blue. Roderick Roach, my guy R squared. Love it. Look at that. Look at that mod representation, baby. Deron Lacey, what up? Mervin Calder, Daniel Sun, what up? How can I be the man? We need a man. We almost got 500 likes. Six away. You're getting ready to go back to action. All humans, what up? AD Grochi. What's going on? <coughs> Appreciate y'all being here. Yes, Irish Rover says hit the like, subscribe, ring the bell. Let's go. You're a New York Giants fan, Mariah. You're in the right place because a lot of this, especially during the fall, it's is all Giants. Um, it's mostly my bread and butter. The Giants and, and Lakers streams. Free throw by Jackson Hayes is no good. Yes, Bordo, the Yankees are doing very well. 10-2, and two, I love to see it, man. It's great. And this without Garrett Cole, so that's really good. George, what's going on? Jackson Hayes does get the second one on the bounce. 13-13, my lucky number, baby. Let's go, Richard Miller, what up? Here we go. Steph Curry with the basketball, has the top of the circle, and throws it to nobody in particular. And the ball's on the ground. It's picked up by Gary Payton. And then the ball is kicked out of bounds. And insane. That went off of Steph Curry. I was going to say, how do they not see that? Pretty helter-skelter uh, sequence there for the Warriors. It'll be Laker basketball. 13-13, Mockingbird Lane. 6 of 9 to go in the first. Uh, Angelique Gonzalez, what's going on? Thank you for being here. Appreciate you. Tony Edwards, how we doing? What's up? Al Maricott, Leslin Morris. And there's Jackson Hayes of the basketball. Throws it back outside to LeBron James. LeBron down low. Another turnover, man. The Lakers turn the ball over like it's their job. But Zimski steps back for three. It's good. 16 to 13. Golden State up by three. 540 to go in the first quarter. Stupid broccoli haircut. I don't understand why somebody would cut their hair into the shape of a broccoli, but that's what Podzimski's got going on there. Of course, I have no hair, so I'm no one to talk. LeBron for three! Swish! Cheese! Sam Atriolo cash is king, and the king is cash, and it's 16 to 16. 520 to go. Lakers are three out of five in downtown. Warriors are four to six, and now they're five out of seven as Curry's fouled and the basket. So the Warriors will cool off. Don't worry about it. This is not really a very good basketball team. The Lakers really do miss Anthony Davis. Bad foul by Austin Reeves. Socrates Antonopoulos. What's going on? Thank you for watching from Brazil, my friend. Appreciate you. Sean Paul Matchu. What up, Zach Orr? How are we doing? Hit that thumbs up, subscribe, ring the bell. 518 likes. Appreciate you being here. My cravings, 9 a.m. Where are you from? 
Free throw, no good. Wow, Curry missed a free throw. That is unlike him. Mr. Yes, yes, he did. <laughs> exactly. Very interesting. Here is Austin Reeves in the basketball. Going to give it off to LeBron James. Torian Prince into the game for the Lakers. LeBron with the basketball. Goes around Kaminga. At least tries to. Kicks it out. Rui open for three. No good. Off the backboard. Rebounded by Podzimski. He'll give it off here to... We can't tell who that is. Draymond Green now has it in the corner against Rui. Draymond driving along the baseline. When he finds Podzimski, grabs a beautiful pass there by Draymond Green. 21-16, Golden State by five. Here's Austin Reeves in the basketball. Going to go down low here to Rui. Rui against Gary Payton. Squares him up. And an offensive foul on Rui. Nope, I'm sorry. That's on Gary Payton. 21-16, Golden State by five. Zach, thank you for subscribing, buddy. Really appreciate that. And thank you for liking the video. Really appreciate that, too. Let's go. Let's go. Yeah, the energy's not really good. KJ Keepers, what up, man? Tanya Edwards, what up? Appreciate y'all being here. 527 likes. Appreciate that, too. Austin Reeves looking to inbound. Going to give it off here to LeBron James. LeBron against Curry. I'm sorry, it's Prince. And Prince had a strip. Five turnovers for the Lakers in the first quarter. Curry down the lane and it's stripped. And it's out of bounds. 420 to go in the first quarter, everybody. 420 to go in the first. 420 crew, you know what to do. Smoke them because you got them. Smoke weed every day. Clippers are beating the Suns 17-2. to That's obviously good news. But the Lakers have got to find a way to win this game. Thunder and Kings are tied at 105. 210 to go in the fourth. Keeping an eye on that, too. Anthony Davis is not playing tonight, Joshua. No, unfortunately, he is out with a, a migraine, I guess. And, wow, that was a point-blank shot missed by Kaminga. Rebounded there by Rui. Going to give it off here to Austin Reeves. Reeves brings it into the front court, drives around a screen. Down the lane he goes. He's hammered and almost went in. He'll go to the line for two. Uh, Technico, what up? Yeah, get yourself some Doritos, some Fritos, whatever you got to do. Don't forget the Fritos, is my guy. There he is. Lally Lou says, don't forget the Fritos. You want to see some Castle in tonight? You might get him. I'd rather see him over Harry Giles. So Reeves at the free throw line for two. And Reeves misses the free throw. Five turnovers in the first quarter and one out of three from the free throw line for the Lakers. Uh, a Laker game in person, a playoff game in person, probably never, unfortunately. I live in New York, Austin, so that'd be one hell of a flight. I say all the time, Jeannie needs to give me some tickets and get me over there. But maybe before I leave this earth, I can get over to Los Angeles, not for a playoff game, but just to experience Los Angeles in a and a Laker game from the forum, or from the forum, from the Crypto.com Arena. No layoff for Broccoli Head, Podzimski, 23-17. You know, when I was growing up, we had mullets, and I remember the mullet was a terrible look. I never had a mullet. Cam Reddish is absolute trash and totally misses the layup there. Uh, here comes Podzimski back the other way, going to give it off, and Chris Paul, though, about the three, doesn't take it. Podzimski throws up a wild shot, rebounded by Rui Hachimura. Gives it out here to... Cam Reddish, who, again, I, I don't even know what his point is. Hopefully Vanderbilt is back soon. I don't know what the deal is with him. Gabe Vincent's still not playing either. I thought Gabe Vincent was okay. Rui for three. That one's off. Lakers not shooting well, not handling the basketball well, not shooting free throws. The trail by six. Coming at top of the circle, getting rid off to Budzimski. Which I'm probably saying his name wrong, and I really don't care. Coming with the basketball in the low post against Austin Reeves. Coming at double teamed. Finds Podzimski right down the lane. The alley-oop, 25-17. Lakers' energy is really bad in this first quarter. That's uh, Trace Davis-Jackson with the basket. Lakers are 6 out of 17. That's 35%. The Warriors are 10 out of 19. And the Lakers have also turned it over a ton. That ball was blocked by Trace Davis. Lakers complaining about a goal 10. It should have been a goal 10. It hit the backboard, and then he blocked it. I don't know why that wasn't a goal 10. Lakers come back the other way. Rui with a sidestep. That one's blocked by Davis. And Austin Reeves gets the loose ball in the corner. Reeves tries to drive on Chris Paul. Give it off to Rui inside the free throw line. The jumper and he tickles the twine. 25-19. Golden State by 6-16 to go in the first quarter. We'll take a TV timeout. 
Golden State up by six. Let's get 600 likes. We're 39 away. We got 1452 in here. Appreciate you guys goes being again. Hit the thumbs up, subscribe, ring the bell. I'll be live again. Lakers play the Grizzlies on Friday night. I'll be live at 745. The Thunder are now up 108 to 105 against the Kings with 36 seconds to go. So huge because the Kings have one more. Like they played one less game than the Lakers. But if the Lakers can win tonight and the Kings lose, the Lakers are then an eighth. And if the Suns lose, the Lakers will be a half game out of seventh. Thunder are now up 110 to 105 with 36 seconds to go in the fourth quarter. That's a hell of a comeback because when I looked, the Kings were up like 65 to 44, whatever it was. It was a lot. It was like 64 to 43. Uh, 64 to 45 is what it was at the half. That's what it was. 64 to 45 at the half. The Kings were up. And that's what I saw. And I'm like, oh, God. Like, but Thunder, Thunder could pull this one out. Thunder about scored them 65 to 42 in the second quarter. Or uh, second half. Freddie Derama. What up? Never keep it real. How are we doing? Irish Rover in the house. Matthew Sintron. What up? Ant-Man finished with 51. Cuz Snoop. What up? Tariq. What's going on? Thank you for being here. Appreciate you, man. 577. 23 away from 600. Keep it up. Keep it up. Keep it up. Keep it up. Max Warner, what up? Yes, the Yankees look great. Musanj Moyo says they're down 19 already. Somebody said it was 17 to 2 at one point. But the Lakers got to win. The Lakers got to take care of business. If they if the if the Kings and Suns both lose and the Lakers can pull this out, they'll gain a game on the Warriors, obviously, because they beat down the Kings and the Suns. I don't expect the Pelicans to lose to the Blazers. Uh, but you know, you never, you never know. Um, this game must be in a timeout because it's just saying 36 seconds to go there. Um, hopefully the Lakers just got to find a way to win this game, man. The Pelicans are up 13 to 11 early in that one. Now they're up 15 to 11. Clippers are up in the Suns 23 to four. And yes, the, the game that I was just looking at, where is that? Where did that go? Yep, there's Kings and Thunder, 110-105 still. Uh, L.A. Lou, they you being a member for 55 months, brother. I knew Yankees would play better baseball when they added two ballers of Verdugo and Soto and shed the mundane Donaldson, Hicks, and Higashioka. Yes, I love Verdugo. I, I said that Verdugo was like a sleep because of Soto obviously got all the attention, but I felt like Verdugo was a ball player. And an you know an underrated pick like a sleeper pick, and he got out to a slow start, but he's been raking uh, recently. So I really liked. I just call him Doogie, uh, but I, I'm going to do the Yankees tomorrow. I'm going to do a Yankee game tomorrow night. Obviously, I took a day off tomorrow. I part of my vacation. I took an extra day because I figured jet lag, late game. So I'm going to go to the gym early when my son's in school. My wife's going to go to the gym, get my shit done. We're going to do the Yankees tomorrow night. Hopefully you guys and girls will tune in for that if you're a Yankee fan. We always got 600 likes. We got 588. Let's keep it up. Lakers got to play some damn defense. I should have dropped the, the drop, and they don't as Kaminga's fouled by Cam. Why? I miss Vanderbilt, man. Cam Reddish is so... Cam, used, Cam Reddish is about as useful as a screen door on a submarine. For real. Retro Jersey Podcast. What up, Granny Candy? How we doing? Thank you for being here. HTTR Carson, I'd be fine with either one of those guys. I just don't want McCarthy. Kaminga makes a free throw 26-19, what has been a sluggish first quarter for the Lakers tonight. If you're just tuning in, no Anthony Davis for Los Angeles. LeBron James is playing, but he's not out there right now. He's taking his normal rest at the end of the first quarter. Both free throws are good, 27-19. The fact that the Lakers have shot 35% from the field, have turned the ball over a ton of times, and the Warriors are shooting over 50%. The Lakers are only down by eight. That's actually a good thing. The ball is knocked out of bounds and last touched by the Warriors, who seem to have a lot more energy than the Lakers do uh, so far in this one. Thunder now up 112-105, so it looks like the Thunder are going to win that game, guys. That's big. Lakers got to win, man. They got to win. We need all the good vibes you can get tonight. 
Cam Reddish with the basketball. Reddish down the lane. Reddish lost the basketball. Got it back. Finds Hayes with the floater. And he tickles the twine. Cam Reddish got lucky. That ball went right back to him. And Jackson Hayes was able to finish. Jackson Hayes has definitely played uh, pretty well here without Christian Wood in there. I don't even know what the deal is with Christian Wood. Chris Paul with the fadeaway makes it 29-21. Golden State up by 8. 85 seconds to go in the first quarter. Warriors shooting a ridiculous percentage in this quarter. Lakers are not. Here's Rui Hachimura getting free at the top of the circle. Rui goes around a screen. Uh, unmasked bloodbender. Very nice. That shot's no good. Thank you for the super chat. Appreciate you, brother. Who should the Giants not know? J.J. McCarthy. They should not draft him there. Clay, yep. 132-21. This, this game, uh, Warriors just shooting the ball. They're on fire right now. There's no... Nothing you can do. They're like shooting 70% from three. That has to cool off. The nice pass in a two-handed. Boom! Shagalaga. For Jackson A's, 32-23. But yeah, no, no, uh, no J.J. McCarthy. And another three for the Warriors. I mean, you, you have got to be kidding me with this bullshit. These guys are not that good. All they do is shoot threes, but this is absolutely ridiculous as Broccoli Head knocks down another three. That haircut just pisses me off. I don't understand why you would cut your hair and shave over broccoli. You figure it out. Here's DeAndre Russell with the basketball. Kicks it out. Here's a three for Dinwiddie. And a swish cheese sandwich. Spencer did with three. 35-26. Golden State leads by nine. Kings have lost. So this game is obviously huge for the Lakers. They got to find a way to win this game. Chris Paul with the basketball gives it off and count the basket in the foul as Trace Davis just runs right into Jackson Hayes, 37 26. Yep, Thunder won, so the Kings lost. Lakers have an opportunity. To pick up a game there, the Clippers are up 28 to 4 on the Suns. 28 to 4. Yeah, Doug, the defense is not good for the Lakers. We know that. Yeah, Cheddarette. What up, Cheddarette? How you doing, buddy? I told Laker fans they need to be Clipper fans tonight. Need the Clippers to win that game. 28 to 4, as this one's 38 to 26. And again, that Laker defense is just not good. And we know it's not good. The Warriors are just shooting an ungodly percentage here in the first quarter. Keep in that thumb. We almost got 700 likes in the first quarter. That is freaking amazing. Appreciate that. Um, and a foul. We lost. You weren't there, LeBron and AD. Well, I mean, they won two games and I didn't call a game. I was on vacation, John. I was I was out of town for a week. Gotta take a vacation. I gotta take time to live my life now and again. It's gotta happen. Gotta, gotta have some vacation. Wow, they're going to say D'Lo is shooting a three from inside half court. Wow. D'Lo, that's a big break for the Lakers. D'Lo makes the free throw. D'Lo was pulling up in the just inside half court. There's two seconds to go, and he got fouled on a three. Makes the second one. 38-28. Warm up coming here for D'Lo. Angel and Sia, what's going on? Keeping that thumbs up, subscribing that bell, guys and girls. Come on, baby. I may, I guess it would be, I mean, I can't cut my hair into the shape of anything anymore. I don't have any. All three free throws are good. And the Lakers lead 38-29 as Draymond hits the shot clock on that shot. And that is the end of the first quarter. Not a good first quarter for the Lakers. They trail by nine. 12 minutes in the books. Lakers so got to pick up their D. OZ Beer, what up? Darcy, Posadas, what's going on? Care you? Like I said, the mullet was a terrible look. I never had my hair in the shape of a mullet. But you look back at some of these styles and you're like, what the hell did I do that to myself for? That broccoli haircut is going to be one. These kids look back at themselves 20 years from now and go, what the hell? Why would I cut my hair like a poodle? They're, they're going to look back and go, why did I shape my hair like a poodle? Like, why do I want to look like a poodle? I don't know. I'm old, man. What the hell can I tell you? I don't I don't understand the crap today. I don't <laughs> What I do understand is Lakers gotta get their shit together. We gotta get these likes up here. 
Sierra on Earth, what up? Temple of Praise, Christina, Sasha. Yes, I agree with you, Christina. Cam Reddish is, like I said, as usual as a screen door in a submarine, a solar-powered flashlight. He just out there running cardio. Nigel Watts, what up? Where are bags? No Anthony Davis tonight, unfortunately. Uh, Dono Talt, what up? 22 points in the last two minutes. Oh, yeah. That, yeah, they did score a lot of points in the last two minutes of that. Jason Halep, what up? <clears throat> Ronaldo Ferguson, Liquid Swords. Yeah, Anthony Davis not playing tonight, unfortunately. Yeah, your hair on strike two, R squared. Yep, yep. My hair, my hair decided to go on strike two, without question. But see, I have a seven year old. I won't let my kid cut his hair like that. The fade never dies. Like the haircut that I had when I was in high school. The fade is still a very good looking haircut. It's just I have the reverse fade going now. You know, the fade was where you had it on the top and you blended it into your sides or you had really no hair on the side of your head, but you blended the top of your hair into your, and it looked great. Now it's the complete opposite. I have it here and then it goes up here and it just disappears. But my kid, you know, we always do that. My kid's a very handsome young man. You've seen him before, so he has a good haircut. I'm not going to let him look like a poodle. Clinton Edwards from Jamaica, what's going on? Retro Jersey Podcast, what up? DG Fiend, how you doing? You know I got to talk trash to the opponents. I always got to do that crap. You know how we do it. Travis Richardson, Life Journey, Badass Trucker, what up? I hope they're not garbage tonight. Artem, what up, man? 658 on likes, love to see it. Ryan, man, I've been on vacation. I was on vacation the last week. I left Wednesday morning and I came back this morning. So I didn't, I wasn't able to do the, wasn't able to do the, um, the last three games, the Lakers did beat the Wizards, which they should have. They did beat the Cavs. They beat them convincingly. And then I was able to, like I said, I kept up with the games. And Sunday night, I was able to watch a game from my hotel room. Blazers now only down by one in that one. The Clippers are up 35 to 6, guys. 37 to 6. The Clippers are up 37 to 6 with 45 seconds to go. Lakers have got to find a way to win this game, man. Suns ain't going to come back from that. They're down 31 points in the first quarter. They got it. The, the Lakers have got to find a way to win this one tonight. They got to. They've got to, man. Tom Schultman, what up? Thank you for being here. Appreciate it. Let's go. Almost 700 likes. Keep hitting that subscribe. Ring the bell. The umpires are horrible, Dashy. I saw your posts in the Instagram, like the IG chat. And the, the umpiring's terrible, bro. I feel you. Uh, Stacy, what up, buddy? Patrick Onolario, Marming, Salamat, Mangadunga, Manga, my friend. CLD, what up? <laughs> and the alley oop. And Trace Jackson throws it away. It wasn't a good pass. Lakers come away with the basketball. LeBron back out there. Delo has it over on the wing, kicks it out to. Uh oh. Who the hell is number seven? Who the hell is seven on the Lakers? Why do I not know this? LeBron had it stripped away. Oh, it's Gabe Vincent. <laughs> yeah, I saw Gabe Vincent play one game. I forgot. Guess Gabe Vincent's out there. I totally forgot about Gabe Vincent. Delo steps back. Tough shot. No good. Boy, the Lakers are just really, really struggling from the field early on here. Kaminga with the basketball. Has it. Gives it off to Trace Davis. Back to Broccoli head over on the left wing, driving down the lane, throwing it off, a foul, and shot will not go. Foul on Cam Reddish, what else is new? That'll send Kaminga to the free throw line for two. Warriors up by nine. Lakers have struggled. I guess the foul's actually on Gabe Vincent, not Cam Reddish. 37-6, to 37-7 now. 37-8 to is the end of the first quarter. Lakers have got to find a way to win this freaking game, man. Got to, got to, got to, got to. The Lakers have got to find a way to win this game. No good there by Kaminga. Wants to punch the basketball after missing the shot. Makes the second one. Just to tell you really quick, the Lakers, the Warriors are 7 out of 10 from downtown. Lakers, the Warriors are shooting 70% from downtown and 58% of the field. The Lakers are shooting 35, 38% of the field. The fact going down by 10 is amazing because they could not have got off to a worse start. The Warriors could not have got off to a better start. 
Jackson Hayes looking for LeBron James. Gives it to him down low post. He spins on Clay, goes right around and lays it in with a little kiss. Strong baseline drive by LeBron. Cuts it to 8, 39, 31. LeBron looks to turn in the night. Lakers going to need to play some defense. Here's Kaminga on the low post against Jackson Hayes. Kaminga now steps back outside the three-point line. Jackson Hayes tries to stay in front of him. Kaminga in the lane. Turns, throws up a brick. Good box out by Jackson Hayes. Gives it off to LeBron. LeBron brings it into the front court for the Lakers over on the right wing. LeBron James looks to spin on Kaminga. Now he looks to back Kaminga down. Kaminga try to poke it away. LeBron around the screen. LeBron down the lane. LeBron all the way to the rack with a little scoop. There it is. A little kiss by LeBron James. 39-33. Chris Paul in the basketball. Throws up a shot. No good. Battle for the rebound. Trace Davis gets it. Gives it off there to Podzimski. Back outside, Clay for three. Yup, the Warriors are shooting 73% from downtown in this game. 73%. New Orleans and Portland in a battle. The Trailblazers trail that by one. We're keeping an eye on that as well. Dealer with the basketball, going to give it off to LeBron James. You know the Warriors have got to cool down. Just law percentages tell you they do. Bit of a look there by Braun as he finds D'Lo who lays it into the front of the rim. And it's 42 to 35. Golden State by 7. 9.35 to go in the second quarter. Chris Paul in the basketball. Give it off to Clay off a screen. Clay gives it back to Trace Davis. Just call him TDJ. It's just easier that way. CP3 pulls up from the elbow and throws up a UFO. You don't see that very often from there. D'Lo for 3. Swish. Cheese. Sandwich 3. Angela Russell cuts it. They're 42 to 38. Lakers gonna play some damn. Trace Jackson with the basketball. Gonna give it off to Kaminga. Kaminga pulls up for three. Shots short. Rebound grab by Jackson Hayes. Hayes gives it off to Gabe Vincent. Vincent pulls up for three. What the hell was that? Everybody, watch your head. Gabe Vincent threw up an iron pipe. Watch your head. That's a fail on my part. Try this. That shot's no good. Here comes LeBron James back the other way. LeBron down the lane. Bangs into CP3. Goes up. He's fouled. And LeBron will go to the charity stripe for two. 8.41 to go in the first. Golden State up by four. Gregory says, let's get Bad Dog to 1,000 likes. Let's do it. Damn Zuckers, what up? Rory, Joey, how we doing? Zion, Callum, how we doing, man? Rudy Intong Vlog, Callie Roberts, thank you all for being here for the biggest game of the year for the Lakers. The biggest game of the year. Lolo Addis, thank you for that thumbs up. Appreciate you. Let's go. LeBron at the free throw line looking for a couple, and he's way short on that first one. Lakers free throw is not good. Shot's not good. Turnover's not good. George, you're absolutely right, buddy. He says, you need to weather the storm. It's not going to shoot like not gonna shoot like that the whole game. You're right. You're right. They're not going to shoot 70% from downtown. LeBron goes one out of two. 42-39. Again, Lakers got to play. Chris Paul's going to bring it into the front court here for the Warriors. Has it at the top of the circle Gabe, Gabe, against Gabe Vincent. Gives it off to Clay. Clay pulls up with a shot. It's Wow, they called a foul on that. So Clay will go to the line for two. 8.32 to go in the second quarter. Golden State up by three. Christina Bustamante. AD's out with uh, headache and nausea symptoms. Luckily, he's not in concussion protocol. Can we get 1,000 likes by the half? That'd be pretty amazing. We've got 697 people in here, or 697 likes. Clay makes the free throw, 4339. Well, 1,700 people in here, 698 likes. I keep banging, bang, 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 bang. Bang, bang! Like Cactus Jack would say. When we're coming here for Clay, Warriors up by four, 818 to go first. Definitely missed you guys. Not being able to call Laker games. I mean, just trust me. I enjoyed my vacation without question. I enjoyed getting away from things. I was hanging out with my wife and kid. It was a great time. But I definitely, you know, miss calling Laker games. I do enjoy, especially when I was at the hotel and I was watching the game because they played late. I'm like, oh, I could be calling this game right now. But obviously, I didn't miss much because Anthony Davis got hurt and they ended up getting blown out. So that game really didn't mean a lot. Here's DeAndre Russell back to LeBron. LeBron for three off the back of the rim. No good. Rebound there by Andrew Wiggins. Gives it off to Chris Paul. Paul back to Wiggins. Wiggins for three. You have got to be kidding me with this right now. You've got to be kidding me. The Warriors are shooting 75% from three-point range. 
47-39, Golden State by eight. Here's Torian Prince in the lane. Prince goes up and lays it in with a little kiss. It's always the best when Prince lays in with a little kiss. 47-41. Here is Andrew Wiggins with the basketball. Has it at the top of the circle. Wiggins pulls up for three again. What is going on here? 10 out of 13 from downtown. It's 50-41. to 41. This is absolutely ridiculous how lucky these guys are. Nobody shoots that well from downtown. There's another turnover to Lakers. Actually, they get a back. Delo pulls up for three. No good. Jackson Hayes back taps it to uh, Gabe Vincent. Down low to Jackson Hayes. Hayes finds LeBron James. Lakers trying to turn it over the best that they can. <laughs> LeBron with the basketball. Driving in the paint. Goes up and lays a missed the shot. Missed the tip. LeBron missed the layup. Rebound by Steph Curry. Brings it into the front court for the Warriors. Just under seven minutes to go. Draymond will throw up a three. And Are you, are you kidding me right now? This is the most ridiculous bullshit I've ever seen. They're not 11 out of 16. Draymond Green, 3 for 3 from downtown. you got to be shitting me. He's one of the worst three-point shooters in the league. Lakers trail by 12. Lakers playing no perimeter defense whatsoever. LeBron gives it off, gets it back. LeBron's got two to shoot, has to heave up a shot, throws up an air ball, 24-second shot clock violation. Probably didn't take a timeout. But Darvin Ham don't use his timeouts. Where's the timeout? 626 to go in the second quarter. Warriors are shooting a ridiculous percentage from downtown. Dream on three for three from downtown is one of the stupidest things you'll ever see. Lakers trail by 12. Daryl Dwayne, what up? Thank you for being here. Appreciate it. Draymond looks like a stomach navel. <laughs> Hit that thumbs up. Let's go. We gotta get we gotta get a thousand likes by the half. We can do this. Rupert Pumpkin, good all might. Thank you for being here. What's the song I played there? Oh, um I don't know what the hell that's called. I just put celebrate on it. Whatever the Rangers, whatever the New York Rangers have during a goal, it's whatever that song is. I don't know what the name of the song is. Well, DG Fee and Lakers are in the play in regardless. Uh, Laura L. Dixon, what up? Seven Moody, what up? Todd, how we doing, buddy? Thank you for being here. Appreciate it. Maybe 420 left. Maybe the Lakers should take a smoke break. I think they took a smoke break already. Calvin L. Magella, what up? Thank you for being here. Thank you all for being here. Musab Imran. I don't think LeBron, I don't think Draymond shoots well from three. Oh, look. But he's never been a good three-point shooter. He's, uh... Where is he? Do, 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 do. Actually, I guess the issue... Well, he shoots 37%. I take that back. I didn't realize Draymond was shooting 37% this year. He's a career 31% three-point shooter. This year, I guess, he's just having a career season from downtown. But yeah, he was always, he's always been a horrible three point shooter, always. So three for three, you know that's just some BS. But the Warriors as a team are shooting fifty four percent. They're shooting sixty nine percent from downtown. Lakers are shooting just fifteen out of thirty seven, and, and just thirty eight percent from downtown. And the Lakers have also turned the basketball over. Three times. Well, it seems like they turned it over more than three times. I know where they get these, uh, where they get these statistics from, like turnovers. Lakers definitely turned the ball over more than three times in this game, without question. Without question. Uh, whoops. Check the other scores. Clippers are destroying the Suns. The Blazers are actually beating. The Pelicans right now. The Clippers are up 51 to 16. 51 to 16 in that game. 51. 53 to 16. Lakers got to find a miracle and, and pull this out. 
I mean, they they could go past the Suns, or they'd be a half game beyond the Suns. And of course, the Lakers are on the tiebreaker with the Suns. They got to find a way. Clippers are helping them out. It's fifty three to sixteen now. All right, back to action. Lakers trail by 12. <laughs> Golden State with the basketball. Lakers have really struggled offensively tonight. Golden State has not. They've been ridiculously efficient. And there's a steal as... Who is that? LeBron's going to kick it out to Rui for three. Ball is deflected and blocked and a foul. Loose ball foul. Who the hell is out there for the Lakers? Is that Austin Reeves? A bomb for three, no good. Where the hell is the... Oh, it is Reeves. Didn't look like Reeves was back on the court. I don't know who that was. What was another turnover? Gabe Vincent for three and not even close. Lakers got to stop shooting threes. Don't get a three-point shooting contest of these guys. Lakers trail by 12. Reeves going to give it back to Gabe Vincent. Vincent has it over on the left wing. Going to give it down to LeBron James. Lakers offense is struggling. No ball movement whatsoever. Cameron is out there with Rui, Gabe Vincent, Reeves, and LeBron. LeBron triple team finds Rui in the lane. Rui triple team. Rui trying to get free. Rui's tied up, goes up, and can't get the shot to go. Lakers are absolutely just struggling, shooting 30% from the court or from the floor. Terrible, terrible start. And uh, Wiggins lays in 55-41. Tudo, thank you, bro. Appreciate you. Grazie, paisana. Grazie. Thank you. Says massive salutes and respects to Bad Dog and all Dire Giants fans in the building. Greetings from me and the fam in Princeton. God's blessings to everyone. Thank you, Tuto. Appreciate it. I have a bad. This game is going to be over, guys. This game's over. Reeves misses the three. Lakers can't shoot. Warriors make another three, 58 to 41. Lakers are going to fail to capitalize on the Suns losing. Um, and the Lakers are going to drop the 10th. So they're going to, Lakers are going to have to win. Back-to-back games on the road just to get into the playoffs. So a 16-2 run, and this one is academic. Lakers couldn't beat the Sisters of Mary tonight. They're down by 17. I came back from Florida for this shit. I came back from Florida for this. Uh, hit that like, subscribe, ring the bell. Let's get these likes up here. Really missing Anthony Davis. You don't buy Bitcoin. You don't put that on my channel. Get out of here with that shit. We're not selling cryptocurrency, which is one of the biggest scams going. We're not, we're not doing that. Get out of here with that crap. Um, Eugene, what up? Thank you for being here. I should have stayed is right. I should have stayed. Plenty of time. There's plenty of time. The Lakers have no energy. The energy sucks. The energy is the energy is very bad uh, for the Lakers right now. Very bad. Very bad. They should have sat. Le- well, LeBron might sit out the re- the second half. Yeah, it seems that way, Francis. The Lakers are two and three without Anthony Davis, and they're. Their uh, average loss, when they lose, they've lost by 21 points. The losses that they've had without Anthony Davis have been by the by an average of 21 points. So, yes, Darvin Ham called the timeout. Darvin Ham. <laughs> Call the timeout. Yes, the Clippers do have the Suns in an eclipse. Too bad the Lakers can't capitalize on it. So... Lakers will be, the Warriors will be one half game behind the Lakers with a game in tow. They will also have the tiebreaker. So the Lakers looking like they will be 10th going into the postseason. So what the Lakers are going to have to hope that happens. They might as well just sit their guys out the last two games of the season. 
The Blazers are actually beating the Pelicans 37 to 28. The Lakers are blowing a golden opportunity to take advantage um, of the Suns getting absolutely housed. The Suns are losing by 33. I can't, I mean, it's early in the Blazers Pelicans game, but the Blazers are winning by nine. The Kings blew a 19 point lead and ended up losing to the Thunder. Everything that the Lakers needed to have happen tonight has happened except for the Lakers are not taking care of their own business. Not taking care of their own business. Yeah, the Lakers without Anthony Davis are, it is bad. It is bad. Yeah, it's just, it just sucks. It just sucks. Now, well, listen, headache, no, I don't know what the deal is with Anthony Davis. The one thing I can tell you is you don't know how somebody's feeling, so it's it's tough. He did start Rui, King Angel. He did. He did start Rui. It's just the Warriors just can't miss. The Lakers can't make a basket. 420 to go in the first half, everybody. 420 to go, second quarter. 420, green, you know what to do. Smoke always got him. Smoke weed every day. LeBron turns and tickles the twine. 58 43. Lakers trail by 15. But nobody else has really stepped up. We have not heard. LeBron's got 14 points. We have not heard anything from Rui. We have not heard anything from D'Lo. And Gary Payton missed that layup rebound here by Austin Reeves. Reeves brings it into the front court. Going to give it off to LeBron. LeBron has a double team. Out to Reeves. Reeves for three. Swish. Cheese. Sandwich Austin. Three. Lakers play. 3.33 to go in the second quarter. Lakers trail by 12. Draymond Green dribbling down the lane with the left hand. Finds Gary Payton. Payton kicks it back out. Wiggins for three. Hey, they actually missed. I don't believe it. Dinwiddie comes away with a rebound. Dinwiddie gives it off to Reeves. Out to LeBron. LeBron throws it to nobody. Turnover Los Angeles. Mustard off the hot dog. LeBron didn't look. Thought Rui was in the corner. Rui was in the low post. Some dude has a shitload of ice in the crowd. <clears throat> Curry for three. Yup. 61-46. Warriors shooting 72% from downtown. Here comes... Uh, Lakers only have 46 points in this half, too. It's not like them, but you can tell they miss Anthony Davis. They can't win without Anthony Davis. They really can't. Here is uh, Rui in the lane. Rui had a block, and that should be a jump ball. They call it travel. How is that a travel? That should be a jump ball. Yeah, freaking idiot official... If the ball's blocked and he comes down with it, it's a jump ball. It's not a damn travel. One official calls a travel, the other calls a jump ball, and then the other official officer says, yeah, jump ball. What are you, stupid? You don't know the rules? If the, the ball's blocked and the guy comes down with it, it's not a travel. Lakers need a miracle. Trailing by 15, a Warrior team shooting 72% from beyond the arc. Utterly ridiculous. And the Warriors win the tip. Here comes Broccoli head into the front court for the Warriors. Going to give it off there to Draymond Green. Green gives it back to Broccoli Head. Throws it up. Bad pass. Stolen away by Rui. Rui down the lane. Rui throws it up and he's fouled as he couldn't dunk it. A good foul there by Andrew Wiggins. Don't give him the dunk. Make him earn that. Rui read that one like a playboy. Hit that thumbs up. Subscribe. Ring the bell. Come on, baby. We need your energy. The Lakers need your energy. Good God Almighty. The Lakers got to get this thing under 10 going into the half. They can win without Anthony Davis. They're 2-3 and three without him. And their average margin of defeat has been 21 points when he's not in there. So they have not played well without Anthony Davis. They did beat Boston without him. Lakers got to get this thing, like I said, you got to get it to under 10. If you can get this game to 8 or 9 going into the half, you got to feel pretty good. Rui makes both free throws because the Warriors are just shot ridiculous, and the Lakers are shot so poorly 
The law of averages would tell you the Lakers should come back, but here's another three for the Warriors, and it's good. I mean, you, this is just unfucking believable. I've never seen a team shoot this well in my life. Draymond Green is four for four from downtown. I mean, this is just stupid. An outlier game because this does not happen. Draymond Green is 4 for 4 from downtown. The Warriors are shooting 70%. They're 14 out of 20. And the Lakers just throw up an air ball from downtown. But D'Lo is fouled, so Lakers get a break there. Lakers shooting 37% from the field. Warriors are shooting 55%, 70% from three. And the Lakers are shooting 6 out of 18 from downtown, 33%. Bad foul there. D'Lo makes the free throw. Makes the second free throw. 64 to 50. Lakers have got to find some defense someplace. They've got to find some defense someplace. D'Lo has one more coming for the charity stripe here. 153 to go in the second quarter. LeBron on the bench resting the last 113 seconds. All three free throws are good. 64 to 51. Draymond Green will give it off here to Andrew Wiggins. The Warriors just shooting a ridiculous percentage. And again, you would think the law of averages would catch up to him, but it hasn't in this first half. Wiggins against Rui. Wiggins drives in the paint, spins, goes up, and lays it in. 66 to 51. Again, that Laker defense non-existent. Without Anthony Davis, the defensive energy is awful. Reeves pulls up and almost threw it away. Had to give it off to Jackson Hayes. He gives it back there to D'Lo. D'Lo around a screen. Throws it out in the corner. Dinwiddie for three. Swish. Cheese. Sandwich Spencer Dinwiddie. Three. Warriors lead by 12. Again, the shooting for the Warriors is just stupid. Clay Thompson, and there's another layup. Well, they're going to call a goal 10. What about another layup anyway? 68 to 54. TNT says 69 to 54. That's a goal 10. Yeah, the difference is, Roderick, this time around, Lakers are going to have to battle themselves from 10th. They're going to have to win two play-in games. Lakers are not challenging. So 68 to 54. That's a goal 10. The ball is on the way down. It's a good call. It's a good non-challenge. It's a good non-challenge. That was a goal 10. We've got to get these likes up here, guys. 820. We are were, we were killing it on our way to 1,000. Let's go. Lakers need those thumbs ups. They need the good vibes. Lakers almost turn the ball over again. Reeves gets free. Gives it off to Hayes, out to D'Lo. Back to Reeves, is open for three. Swiss cheese sandwich, Austin. Three. 68-57. Clay Thompson gives it off. Draymond for three again. Five for five from three for Draymond Green. You got to be fucking kidding me. This is the most ridiculous bullshit ever. Reeves for three again. Swish cheese sandwich. Austin threes. It's 71 to 60. There is no way Draymond Green shoots five for five in any other freaking game. You want to just talk about absolute bullshit. That's it. Chris Paul for three. I'm surprised that didn't go in. Lakers grab the rebound. Here comes Austin Reeves back the other way. Reeves at the basketball against Curry has five seconds to shoot. Tries to get free. Steps back, launches up a three, and hit the front of the rim, and that's the end of the first quarter. 71-60, Golden State by 11, and honestly, it could be a lot worse for the Lakers. could be a lot worse. Uh, big shout-out, guys, girls, to BetUS for sponsoring the channel. You guys know what to do, man. Hit that link in the description and enter the promo code JOIN125. BetUS will give you a 125% match deposit bonus on your first three 
deposits all the way up to $2,500. That means if you use that promo code JOIN125, click that link in the description, you deposit $500, you get $1,125 to play with because BetUS will give you an extra $625. It is the best promotion going of any betting app. Most apps will give you, hey, we'll give you a 100% match deposit uh, you know, up to $200. You get up to a $2,500 bonus three times. I don't care where you bet. Take advantage of BetUS now. Take advantage of it. If you like to bet on stuff, get the free money while supplies last, as they say, right? Click that thumbs up. Also, the first five people that DM me either on Instagram or Twitter, their account number, BetUS is going to give you free $25. You're, all you got to do is give me your account number. Don't need to give me your name. Don't need to give me your address. Sign up. Send me your account number. I give it to the good people at US. They give you $25 to play with. Terms and conditions apply. They give you free $25, though. Just for signing up. Payouts within 24 hours. Great customer service. Like I said, take advantage of BetUS. Take advantage of it now. Let me give you guys and girls the statistics. It is ridiculous statistics for the Warriors. I mean, just absolutely ridiculous how well they shot in that half. And like I said, the law of averages, you would think they'd have to come down at some point. You know, hit that thumbs up, subscribe, ring the bell. Cheddar Red, Cheddar Red's Clippers are doing the Lakers a big favor. The Lakers need the Clippers to win. Clippers are going to win. Right? Clippers are up by 33 at the half. Suns lose, Lakers win. Lakers are a half game behind the Suns. They need to come back. They need to come back. This is just stupid. For the Warriors, Draymond Green is 5 for 5, all of them from downtown. You'll never see that shit again. He's probably never hit five threes in a row in his life at any level. And tonight he decided to do that. 15 points, five assists, three rebounds. The fact that the fact that Draymond Green is their leading scorer is just stupid. Okay. Trace Jackson, uh, two out of four, five points. Uh, whatever. Trace Davis Jackson. Trace Jackson is gonna call him that. Andrew Wiggins, four to six, two out of three from downtown, ten points. Steph Curry, four to five, three out of three from downtown, eleven points. Clay Thompson, five out of eight, three out of six from downtown, fifteen points. Jonathan Gaminga was 0 for five, had three points. Chris Paul, one for four, two points. Gary Payton over two didn't score. Broccoli had Podzimski, four to five, two out of two from downtown, ten points. The Warriors shot an ungodly 25 out of 44 from the field, 56.8%, and an absolutely stupid 15 out of 22 from downtown, 68% from downtown. They out rebounded the Lakers 22 to 21. For the Lakers, Rui not stepping up. Rui's had a great year, but he's just 2 for 11. 1 out of 5 from downtown, 7 points by rebounds. LeBron James is 6 out of 13, 1 out of 3 from downtown, 14 points, 4 assists, 3 boards. Jackson Hayes, in place of the injured Anthony Davis, 3 out of 4, 7 points, 5 rebounds. D'Lo just 2 out of 6, 1 out of 3 from downtown, 11 points, 5 assists. Austin Reeves is 4 out of 8, he's 4 for 6 from downtown, 13, 3 and 3. Torian Prince had one shot, he had 2 points. Cam Reddish just running cardio for 8 minutes, didn't score. Spencer Dinwiddie knocked down a couple of 3s, he had 6 points. Gabe Vincent took 2 3s, missed them both. Didn't score. Lakers 20 out of 50, 40%. 9 out of 22 from downtown, 41%. Team stats look like this. From the free throw line, the Warriors are 6 out of 8. The Lakers are 11 out of 14. Uh, the Lakers have turned the ball over four times. The Warriors have turned it over seven. The Lakers actually lead in fast break points 9 to 3. Points in the paint, Warriors. Some of you, you know the Lakers are missing Anthony Davis. And the Warriors have taken 22 threes. And they have 20 points. The Lakers 18 in the paint. Warriors have led by as many as 17. The Lakers have led by one. 71 to 60 at the half. And like I said, with the way the Warriors have shot, that could have been a lot, lot, lot worse. Tricksters, thank you, bro. Appreciate you, my friend. And Brilly, Brilly, my man. Where am I? Uh, I want this right here. Of course, Draymond goes off again. Yeah, it's just stupid. I mean, you, you, he'll never do that again the rest of his life. And probably never did it before tonight. Anthony, thank you, bro. If the Lakers lose, I'm not surprised. I hope they don't. I hope they don't. Uh, but now that I ran those, uh, gave you the stats, you know what time it is for me. I got to go potty. 
I'm going to run the one ad that I run because I do not run ads during this, so I don't make any money off of these streams from the ad revenue, but I do have to plug my sponsor, Aura. Make sure you guys sign up for Aura. Get a free 14-day trial for great cyber security, identity theft protection, a VPN, uh, keep these data brokers from getting your information and selling it to people on the black market so you're not getting scammed, you know, all these spams and scams and all this other crap in your email, all these cookies that they put in there, get rid of the spyware, all that stuff. Sign up for Aura. I'm going to run that and I'll be right back. You guys hit that like, subscribing the bell. Let's go. This video is brought to you by the good people at Aura.com. Have you guys ever done a Google search for your name or email address? You might be surprised at the amount of information that comes up out there. It makes me uncomfortable and it should make you uncomfortable too. That's why I have Aura.com. Data brokers sell your information to scammers, spammers, and anyone else who may want to target you. Your full name, email address, home address, health records, relatives, it's all out there. And that's why I've been using Aura, the sponsor of today's video. Aura shows you which data brokers are selling my information and automatically submits opt-out requests for me. Cleaning up my information not only helps reduce the amount of spam I get, but it protects me from hackers who can use this information to help them access my social media accounts, bank accounts, and other sensitive information. Aura also does so much more to protect me and my family from online threats I can't see. I get other features like antivirus, VPN, password management, parental controls, identity theft insurance, and more without having to download several different apps. It's really easy to set up. And best of all, I get everything at one affordable price, which is about $12 a month. You may already have one or two of these tools, but not having auras like locking the front door and leaving the back door wide open. I value my privacy and you should value yours too. You can go to the link in the description to start your free two-week trial. Stop data brokers from exposing your personal information. Go to my sponsor, Aura.com, to get that free 14-day trial and see how much of your information is being sold. BetUS, America's favorite sportsbook and casino. Live betting and racebook. We're celebrating 30 years with a historic offer. A 125% sign-up bonus on your first three deposits. Plus 10% gambler's insurance. Get started today. BetUS, where the game begins. All right. We back. We back. We back. I can't believe the Warriors are shooting this well. But again, you got you to gotta think at some point that's got to slow down. 71 to 60, it could be a lot worse. Cue ball, what up? Thank you for the like button. Romans at 900 likes for the half. Appreciate that. Let's go. Let's go. Smack like it. Subscribe. Ring the bell. Let's go, baby. Kendall Pierre, how going to be the man when you demand? Benjamin, what's going on, buddy? Yes, I was on vacation, my man. We took uh, the family to Disney. Let's go. CLD, thank you for the like button. Sione Durana, it was my son and wife's birthday. So we got to do it. And the uh, kid lost a tooth on his birthday. Well, no, he lost a tooth a couple days before his birthday. Um, Nelly, my lady, Jaden Finch, what up? Michael or me, how we doing? Always going to see my guy Benjamin in the house, though, without question. Joe Cordoza, don't worry, Prince Hachi. More. Hey, listen, I ain't worried about the Lakers offense. I'm worried about their defense. Um, Gemini Don, we have at least an 88, 5% without Brown. The two bad, no AD. Suns losing a bad Pelicans are losing Kings lost. I know that's what I'm saying. The Lakers have got to take advantage of this. They got to take advantage of this. The Suns are going to lose. The Blazers are up by three, which I can't even believe. But the Lakers, I mean, it'd be amazing if the Blazers could hold on and win that game because the Lakers play the Pelicans on Sunday. Lakers can't lose another game this year. They play the Grizzlies on Friday. They should be able to beat them. If the Lakers can find a way to pull this one out and beat the Grizzlies, that game against the Pelicans could be for the Lakers to jump all the way into sixth place. It's paramount that they win this game. Paramount. This is so important for them to find a way to beat this team. They've got to win this game. Got to. Um... Got to get it done, man. <laughs> R squared. Sun's down 33. Me and my girlfriend down 69. <laughs> there you go. 
There you go. Always good to see our guy Benjamin in the house. Look at the mods tonight, man. They're all here. Like they're all here. Benjamin's in the house. R squared, Irish Rover, LA Lou, Dire Giants fan, Janice. I actually haven't seen Afghanistan tonight. I don't think. Jedi's here. I don't think I've seen Afghanistan. They need some smelling salts. They need something. They just need the Warriors to shoot normal. You know, the Warriors are probably, I don't know what they shoot from three. But if they shot 40%, that's an amazing percentage from downtown. The Warriors go back to 40%. It means they're going to shoot 20% from three in this second half. Lakers have got to find a way to, I mean, Draymond Green, five or five. It's just stupid. That doesn't happen ever, ever. Ever. Um, why would you put ice in your soda? It waters it down and makes it flat. That's nasty. Ice in your soda is nasty. It waters it down. It's gross. Why would you put ice in your soda? Are you gonna it ugh, I don't like that. I don't like watered down beverages. Um but appreciate you guys because being here, let's go. Life is yeah, life's always busy, Benjamin. No question, buddy. It is. Usual Pata, what's going on? LeBron and LeBron and AD. I don't think they're making excuses. The Warriors are just shooting ridiculously stupid, to say the least. They just are. Happy guy went up. I hope so, man. I hope so. They The Lakers need it. Keep in that thumbs up. We're at 9.03, so that's good to see. Just got to play defense. That's what it is. Uh, Veneer Operario, what up? Abad Shaman, what up? Arian uh, Pedal Car, when am I going to start the game? Game started, we're at halftime. He had five consecutive threes in game seven. Well, I wouldn't know that. I didn't really care about 2016. Um, I don't really know. You got the munchies now? There you go. Amanda, what up? Shoddy Pippen. No, you, would, you wouldn't think, but they were hot all half. Timothy Jackson not going to be the man when you're the man. Let's go. Mm -hmm. Kyle, what's going on, man? Let's go. Uh, Arian, how can I be the best when you're the best, my friend? Horsepower Bank, hey, what's going on? If a team, if a team have any... Yeah, you're right. It's always against the Lakers, ain't it? But you look at that. The Pelicans lost. I'm sorry. The Kings lost. They're now tied with the Lakers for eighth. But the Kings have the tiebreaker. But the Lakers can pass them. The Pelicans are losing. The Suns are going to lose. If the Lakers won the night, the Lakers would be one half game out of seventh. And sixth, the Pelicans somehow lost to the Blazers. But the Lakers have got to take care of their... Got to take care of this. Um, Danny says, sorry to say this, but you can't, in all caps, your cap sucks, Doug. Sorry to say this, but you can't be a Laker fan. Number one, um, you spelled sense wrong. Sense is S-E-N-S-E, -E, okay? It's not S-E-N-C-E, -E, so I don't know what that means. I don't know what that word means. What does S-E-N-C-E -E mean? Is that a different language? Because that's not the way you spell it. Number two, you don't tell me who I root for what I can and can't do, <laughs> okay? You don't tell me because I'm a Giants fan I can't be a Laker fan. Um, I don't know who the hell you think you are. You don't tell you don't tell somebody who to root for, who they can and can't root for. Who are you? <laughs> who are you? Uh, number three, I'm a Knicks fan. I'm not a Laker fan. And I've always been a Knicks fan and always will be a Knicks fan. I just call Laker games. But I love when people tell you, you can't do this. Who the hell are you? You ain't nobody. You don't tell somebody who they can and can't root for. Ever. Who the hell are you? Benjamin, thank you, bro. Appreciate you. Miss you, bad dog. I miss you too, buddy. You know I do. Great to see all the mods in here. Yes, it is. Yes, it is. He's Dutch. Is that the way you spell sense? Uh, I love it. Yeah, exactly. I'm a grown man. I'm a grown ass man. I love it, people do. You can't root for them. It makes no sense. Well, God, there's Cowboy and Laker fans all over the place. Does that make any sense? Yankee and Laker fans all over the place. 
People can root for whoever the hell they want to root for. You don't know why somebody roots for a team? Maybe my dad was a Laker fan. I just love it. You know, so. Um, Garson Catala, what up? The GOAT, what up? R.I.P. Kobe, indeed. Oh, he misspelled douche. Oh, gotcha. <laughs> Tyler Rao going to be the mayor. Need a man. Only down by 11. I, again, I guess that's good considering the Warriors shot 70% from three-point range, which I just can't wrap my head around Draymond Green being five for five. I just can't. He's a, he's a career 31% three-point shooter. He's not, he's not a good three-point shooter at all. He's got such an ugly shot. Uh, I don't get it. Um, do I think AD wears goggles when he comes back? He should wear the Batman mask. <laughs> or maybe he should put the Kareem goggles on. For sure. Why is Gary Payton mic'd up? I don't know. What's going on? 216 Dink! What was it? A thousand likes. Uh let's go. Appreciate you being here. Getting ready to go to the second half. Warriors have gotta calm down. The Blazers are beating the Pelicans 59 to 55. They're just underway in the third. The Clippers are destroying the Suns 66 to 36. They're just underway in the third there. So the Lakers have got to find a way, man. I cannot, like I said, overstate or stress how important this game is to the Lakers. Danny, thank you, bro. Appreciate you. Brilly, brilly, my friend. Let's go. Thank you for being brave. 7360 is uh, Wiggins makes. Oh, we were in my last chat. You're awesome. Just got back on leave. Really, man. Oh, the Giants show is coming back. Uh, it'll be there Thursday. We started the Giants show again, but I was on vacation last week, so we didn't we didn't do it Thursday. But we'll be back on Thursday. We'll be back on Thursday. LeBron driving along the baseline was bumped out of bounds. No foul call. They give it off to Rui. Rui down the lane. Rui goes up and throws up a brick. And Lakers off to a terrible start here in the third. Here is Andrew Wiggins, fouled by D'Lo. Mustafa Ali, how can I be the man when you're the man? R, what up? Thank you, buddy. Appreciate it. Danny Green, Fernando Marqueda. Hiromitsu, Russell Salome, Dudley Brown, Christian John Boris. Thank you for being here. Hit that thumbs up, subscribe. Draymond down low to Trace Jackson. Turning, firing it up, short. Rebound, Rui. Gives it off to LeBron. Lakers need some kind of spark. I mean, we haven't seen one of those typical 11 to 2 Laker runs. LeBron out to Rui, out to Reeves in the corner for three, and Reeves can't get it to go. The Laker shooting has just been horrible throughout the game. And it just is plaguing them a lot because the Warriors can't miss. And, wow, Trace Jackson has missed a wide. That was a beautiful pass by Draymond, but Trace Jackson couldn't get the layup to go. Reeves of the basketball driving on Curry. Reeves drives, throws it outside to LeBron. LeBron down the lane. LeBron kicks out in the corner. Rui is open for three. Swish cheese sandwich. Rui, hoochie mama! 73-63, Lakers lead by 10. Rui was only 2 out of 11 in the first half for 7 points. Clay makes a 3, pulls up in the elbow. He missed the shot. He was too close, I guess. Rebound the battle. is taken away there by Austin Reeves. Reeves into the front court, running it up. Reeves with the hesitation dribble. The drive gives it off to LeBron. LeBron into the paint. LeBron spins, goes up. Yes! And the foul! Give the hoop in the arm. LeBron James is going to allow it to go. And one! Now that's the type of that's the type of thing we need to see from the Lakers. Irish, thank you, bro. Appreciate you. Give me one of these, baby. Give me a hell yeah. 
Let's shout out Bad Dog and his free Lakers streams. And like us, hit that thumbs up, almost a thousand. Go Yankees, go Giants, and go Lakers. Shout it out to the mods, brothers. A shout out to my mod brothers and sisters. LeBron makes the free throw, 73-66. Lakers got play. LeBron's got 17-3-5. Thank you, Irish Rove. Appreciate you, buddy. Thanks so much, my friend. Down the lane goes Wiggins. Gives it off to Jackson. Blocked by Jackson Hayes, and they call a foul. <laughs> he said, no way. That looked like That looked like good defense to me. That might be a challenge. I don't think Darvin Ham is going to challenge. He does not. And Jackson missed the free throw. Our good friend Rasheed Wallace would say, Ball don't lie, bitch! <laughs> Trace Jackson has one more coming here from the charity stripe. He goes one of the two. The Lakers trail by eight. They got to wake him up. Let's go. The GOAT, what up? Thank you, Rena, guys. Almost 1,000 likes. Come on, baby. Read to the basketball down the lane. He goes all the way to the rack. Lays it with a little kiss. Strong drive by Austin Reeves and Wiggins. I'm sorry, Draymond down on the ground. Draymond saying something. Tee him up. Tee him up. Tee him up. Tee him up. Curry trying to get in between. Timeout on the floor. A timeout by Steve Kerr. 74-68. Lakers show by six. Draymond should be teed up. Curry's out there. Nody Afen. Oh, I didn't do this in the first uh, half. So let's do it. Where are you guys and girls watching from tonight or tomorrow? Where are you watching the stream from? Shout it out in the chat. Let me know. Represent your city, your state, your country, whatever. Tell me where you're watching from. Sydney Herrera, what's going on, Nicholas? And let's get a 1,000 likes during this freaking break. We're 35 likes away. Let's go. Let's go. From Sweden. Very nice. Mississippi, I'm my SSI, SSI, PPI. New York City, St. Louis, Dominican Republic, India. Uh, what's going on? Huntington Beach, Oahu in Hawaii. Aloha, my friend. New Jersey, a couple of people from Hawaii. New Jersey's in the house. America, Iowa, New York, China, New England, Riverside, Cali, India, Brooklyn. 808 or more. Oh, we got that already. Bahamas. El Paso, Texas, St. Kitts, Ohio, Olympus, Kingston, Jamaica. That is where Patrick Ewing was born. Baltimore, Jamaica, North Carolina, Ohio, Zimbabwe in the house. Middleton, Connecticut, Australia, Jacksonville, Florida, St. Martin, Gray Beaver, Virginia. Very nice. Winnemucca, Nevada, Cape Breton Island, India, New York, Belize, St. Louis, show me say Dubai. Thank you for watching. Appreciate that. Manila in the Philippines. Marming Salamana, Mangadanga, Manga. Middleton, Alabama, Coachella, Massachusetts, Iowa, Florida, Detroit, Columbus, Kansas City, Philippines and Singapore, New Zealand in the house, Texas, Kenya, Bali. What up? Dublin, Ireland is in the house. Let's go, Dublin. Let's go. A couple of people from Ireland in the house. The Motor City's in the house. New Orleans in the house. Let's go Belize. I'd love to see it. 985 in the likes. Let's go 15 away. The Motor City. A lot of a couple of people from Detroit in the house. Here we go. Southern Cali, SoCal, Texas, Atlanta, the Philippines, Palm Springs, Inland Empire. Let's go Michael Dosith. Check yourself. King Ali Shadi Pippen from Iowa. Nova Econo from KSA. What up? Let's go. Christine Manalo, a coop. Appreciate you being here. Let's go. Yes, international dog as well. Compton. We know. Philippines Marming. Sell them out, my friend. Krista Stomo Aquino. How are we doing? Iwa Beach. Jay Filbert. What's up? 992 likes. Almost 1,000. Uh, the Pelicans, I'll check. They were winning. It was close, though. Pelicans are up 69 to 67. Clippers are up 70 to 44. They're up 72 to 44 now. But yes, the 
the Pelicans are up 69 to 67. Now they're up 71 to 67. I can't see them. Um, I can't see them winning that game. Hey, they missed a three. Hey. Warriors actually missed a three. 74-68, like a shell by six. LeBron James with the basketball. LeBron into the paint. LeBron down the lane, goes up. That should have been a goal, 10. Rebound by Jackson Hayes. Gives it back off to Austin Reeves. And now we do have a foul, and it's on the Lakers. So another turnover for Los Angeles. I actually shouldn't say another turnover. They're actually taking care of the ball pretty well. I've never seen a dude have a longer leash than Draymond Green. This guy punches people, clotheslines people. He's as dirty as hell. He's been teed up a million times, and the dude is allowed to scream at the official a million times and no technical foul. Why does and the Lakers just got teed up and Curry makes the free throw? Can you tell me how the Lakers get teed up and Draymond Green bitched that official the entire half, or I'm sorry, during the entire commercial break, and they don't tee up Draymond Green, but they tee up Jackson Hayes? Can you explain that to me? Can you explain that to me? Draymond Green with the reputation he has, he should be teed up immediately. Clay for three, that's no good. Long rebound comes out to Wiggins, who lost it and got it back. Wiggins has a basketball on the right wing, going to kick it out there to Steph Curry, back to Wiggins. Six to shoot, Wiggins into the paint, down the lane he goes, shot is way off the mark, rebounded by Rui, gives it off to D'Lo. Deal starts over the Lakers, finds LeBron James, and LeBron's alley-oop is too tall for Jackson Hayes. And basket hanging down below is, uh, uh, whatchamacallit there, I can't think of his name, Andrew Wiggins. 77 to 68, Warriors by nine, Reeves. With the basketball out to LeBron. LeBron over to D'Lo. D'Lo fakes the three. Now takes the three. And a swish. Cheese. Sandwich three. <laughs> Angelo Russell. It's 77-71. Golden State. D'Lo's got 14. I don't know why Golden State's score hasn't changed. Curry's foul to go to the line for two. 78 to go in the third. Warriors lead by six. I don't know. There we go. Lakers got to get this done. Thank you for a thousand likes, guys, girls. Appreciate that. Those 15, those between 12 and 16% that always click no, you're always wrong. How does it feel to constantly be wrong as Curry makes the free throw 78%? Always saying, oh, you're not going to make it a thousand likes and we do it every time. Constantly wrong. But keep in that thumbs up because we want as many as we can get. The Lakers need all the good vibes that they can get because they really got to find a way to win this damn game. They trail by eight as Curry makes both free throws. Do not play reddish. I agree. Where's Max Christie? Curry's got 14, four, and four. LeBron James in the basketball. Gives it off to Torian Prince. Prince back to LeBron. Picked up by his good friend Steph Curry. Drives along the baseline. Kicks it out to Reeves in the corner. Out to D'Lo. Off balance three. No good. Rebound by Steph Curry, and Curry brings it up here for the Warriors. Curry with the ball fake on Curry, or I'm sorry, nice pass, and Clay Thompson walked with the basketball. They don't have a call of travel, though. We know that. Nice pass by Steph, but uh, Clay never had control of it. Should have been a travel. 81 71. Here is DeAndre Russell with the basketball. D'Lo finds LeBron James. LeBron in the lane goes up and was hammered. No foul call, but he lays it up and in anyway. 81 to 73. The officiating in this game has been terrible. Here's another wide open three for Golden State, and they actually missed another one. Rebounded by LeBron James on the run. LeBron James throws it to D'Lo, and LeBron was fouled, I guess, on the floor. Keep in that thumbs up, guys. Go subscribing the bell. We'll do this again on Friday night. The Lakers take on the Memphis Grizzlies. We only have two more games after this one. As far as the regular season goes, then we will see where the Lakers finish as far as their playing standings go. And obviously, they can get all the way up to sixth and they could fall to tenth. LeBron James, I'm sorry, Rui the basketball. Actually, it is LeBron James. Nice fake by Reeves. It goes up and Reeves lays it up and in. It's 81 to 75. Golden State by 6, 644 to go. 
Here is Gary Payton. The Lakers don't run at him. He makes the three, 84-75. Some of the shittiest guys on this team making threes. It's unbelievable. Adam, thank you, bro. Appreciate you, man. Brilly, brilly, my friend. Thank you for being brave. As Rui lays in with a little kiss. Hoochie mama. I know you have a gambling sponsor, but do you have any advice to get rid of a gambling addiction? I'm young and lost a lot of money from blackjack. I don't have advice. What I would say, Adam, is there is definitely gambling hotlines. You just have to, um, there's a foul. Just research it on Google. Just type in gambling help hotline. There's lots of numbers you can call for that. Lots of numbers. Actually, most websites have that. But Blackjack, obviously, is a different story. They're not going to have that at a casino. But, yeah, if you have a gambling problem, definitely reach out to somebody. They do have all those numbers. Just research it on Google if you feel you have a gambling problem. Without question. That's why I always give a disclaimer when I... I, I mean, BetUS is a great sponsor, but I always say bet responsibly, man. Always bet responsibly. But, yeah, if you feel you have a gambling problem, all you got to do is plug that in. Gambling help. There's plenty of hotlines you can call. Lakers trail by eight. Peyton misses the second free throw. LeBron rips it out of the air with a one-hand rebound. Reeves gives it off the Rui out in the corner. Dinwiddie for three. Swish. Cheese. Sandwich Spencer Dinwiddie. Three. 85-80. Golden State. Here's Curry for three. Yep. 88-80. The three-point shots by the more it's just stupid how they have not missed at all in this game. Prince in the basketball. Prince drives down the lane, pulls up off balance. No good. Rebound by Draymond. Give it off here to Curry. Curry brings it into the front court here for Golden State. Gives it off to Peyton and lays it in. 90 to 80. Lakers defense just not there at all. Every time Lakers try to make a run, their defense lets them down. Austin Reeves in the basketball. Reeves against Draymond. Ball fake pulls up in the elbow. Shot short. Rebound. Rui goes up and lays in with a little kiss. Hoochie mama. It's 90 to 82. Adam, thank you, bro. Appreciate you. Brilly, brilly, my friend. Brilly, brilly. Online casinos, no. I would never trust an online casino, dude. I, I don't trust anything online because those are usually not regulated. So I wouldn't trust them. I would not trust online stuff. There's a steal by the Lakers. LeBron James in the basketball. Kicks it out to Reeves. Fakes the three. Drives. Gives it off to LeBron. LeBron goes up and lays it in with a little kiss. 4.20 to go in the third quarter. And by timeout, Golden State. 4.20 to go third quarter. 4.20. Crew smoke them because you got them. Lakers trail by six. Smoke weed every day. Hit that thumbs up. Subscribe. Ring the bell. 17. So I thought we'd have a bigger crowd, honestly. Hit that thumbs up. Subscribe. Ring the bell. How my G-Men going to do this here, Gus? Uh, I don't know. I want to see what we do in the draft, but I, I honestly don't know. Keep in that thumbs up, though. Let's get 1,200. 1,200 is always the average. So if we can get 1,200, that's always great. 1,500 is really what we want. James, thank you, bro. Appreciate you, man. Thank you for being a member, too. I just noticed you have the little icon next to your name. So thank you for being a member. And thank you for your first ever Super Chat. I love it. Thank you so much, uh, James. A $2. Ha, la, 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 la. Boom! Shakalaka. Don't forget the Fritos. Bang that thumbs up. Subscribe. Ring the bell. Let's go. We can get 100 more subscribers during this stream. We will crack 134,200. Again, I'll do this again. Lakers Grizzlies Friday night, 745 New York, 445 LA, 745 Saturday morning in the Philippines. They finish on Sunday with the Pelicans at 3.30. I'll be live for that as well. Yes, online casinos are a thing. Um, they're always in my Instagram. Always. I see them all the time. And there's a lot of them. But I I wouldn't trust them. Because, they're not, again, they're not regulated. So I, unless it's regulated, I wouldn't trust it. Um, Jury Ijerpy, what's going on? Thank you for being here. Appreciate it. Mr. Compatible Charlo, what up? Brianna, how do you become a member? Well, appreciate you asking. If you click that little dollar sign there, 
it should say membership and you can pick whatever level membership you want that's the way you do it either that or there's a link in the description to become a member if you choose to do it that way adam thank you bro appreciate you really really my friend let's go Advice to start eating, yeah, well, I can tell you right now, uh, Adam, I, I know it's tough at college. That's why they call it the freshman 15. I know it's tough. Um, yeah. I don't know, what, like, I don't know what school you go to. If there's a store, a grocery store around you, a convenience store around you, someplace that you can get better food than McDonald's or what they serve, um, you know, in the dorm, I would suggest doing that. I would suggest going to you know, the store and getting, like I get, I always get these frozen, like these frozen tykes and chicken strips. So they are, they're cooked already. They just freeze them. So you just have to heat them up, uh, you know, bake them, throw them in a microwave for eight minutes, whatever. Um, that would be my suggestion. Find a store. There's gotta be a store somewhere, um, in the college that like a little convenience, something see if they're like the nearest grocery store or whatever, and, and get something like that. That's what I would do. But I know it's tough when you're in college. And that's what I said. That's why they call that the freshman 15. It means you put on 15 pounds and become a freshman in college because that's usually what it is. So that would be my suggestion if you can find one. All right. Lakers got to play some damn defense here, man. LeBron has 21 points, eight assists, and five rebounds. A guy coming off flu-like symptoms. The Lakers do not have Anthony Davis tonight. Lakers trail by six. They've trailed by as many as 17. The Warriors are just shot ridiculous. Chris Paul gives it off to Kaminga. Kaminga jumped at the ball. It should have been a travel. Paul has to throw up a three. Hey, they actually missed one. Rebounded by Austin Reeves. Lakers with the basketball. They can try to cut into this lead. They can cut it to four with a basket or a three with a three. LeBron James in the basketball. Double teamed in the corner. LeBron's got to give it off. They swing it over to Vincent. Good ball movement. Prince in the corner for three. Short. Rebound by Trace Jackson. Torian Prince has done nothing. Laker bench. Well, didn't what he's done well tonight, but the rest of the Laker bench, not good. Gabe Vincent getting the minutes. Not Max Christie. Chris Paul, the basketball. And Trace Davis. Is, you know, they talk about LeBron James complaining, and LeBron James does complain a lot to the official. You know, LeBron James does complain to the officials a lot. I don't know if anybody complains more than Spencer Dinwiddie. Spencer Dinwiddie complains every time. Every time. And the Pelicans are now starting to pull away from the Blazers. They're up by eight, and the shot is no good as the Warriors are in the bonus. The Clippers still up big on the Suns. They lead 84-60 to as they're coming to the end of the third quarter there. Such a big game for the Lakers. Hit that thumbs up, subscribing the bell. Didn't what he's actually played well tonight. We know we call him Spencer Din shitty when he doesn't. And Davis gets the roll in that second one. 91-84, 330 to go in the third quarter. Lakers trail by seven. It is Spencer Dinwiddie with the basketball. He'll bring it up here into the front court for the Lakers, and he's doing a lot of dribbling. He is a ball hog, and this rotation is awful. Dinwiddie, Prince, Gabe Vincent, D'Lo, and Jackson Hayes. Hayes goes up and throws it down with a two-handed. Boom! Shagalaga. Purple Hayes! All in my brain! Excuse me while I kiss the sky. Clay had to get rid of it on the good defense. Clay now gets free for three. No good. Broccoli head with a rebound. Throws it back outside. Chris Paul with the basketball. Paul gives it up. Oh, my God. How many steps did he just take with the basketball? He knocks down a three. Clay Thompson caught that basketball, took two steps to the left, and then a step to the right and shot without dribbling the basketball. Whenever the Lakers need to get a big rebound, they just can't do it. Dinwiddie cross court to Vincent. Prince is open for three, and that's no good. And again, Torian Prince just struggling. The Lakers bench has been awful. Chris Paul with the basketball. Lakers had this down to six, and now it's up to ten as Chris Paul makes the basket, 96 to 86. Holy shit, they really do not call a travel. And that is a blatant travel. 
Torian Prince of the basketball against Broccoli Head kicks it out there to Spencer Dinwiddie. Dinwiddie with the basketball, driving in the lane, throws it up. Yes! And the foul, give him the open the arm. Spencer Dinwiddie will go to Lavity. Oh, and one, leave a little kiss. I think it was a big kiss. He shot that thing from the elbow. Felt the contact by Chris Paul, who hooked him there, and he threw it up and got the bounce. Dinwiddie makes the free throw. Lakers got to play some damn defense here to get that thing going. 150 to go. Chris Paul just dribbled into the backcourt. Hey, they actually called it. I don't believe it. He didn't. I don't know how the hell they didn't call it the first time. Good defense by Gabe Vincent. Trapped him along the, trapped him right at the half court line. He brought it across and he dribbled in the backcourt. Right there he did it the first time. They didn't call it at all. Dinwiddie with a basketball. Dinwiddie drives on Paul. Throws it out to Gabe Vincent. <laughs> Lost the basketball. Clay Thompson has it. Wide open three for Broccoli Head. Good. It's 99-89. This guy right here, this Podzimski guy, this is my Dante DiVincenzo this year. I want to punch the guy right in the face. He's just so annoying to look at. And then Dinwiddie throws the ball off the side of the backboard looking for a foul. Taken away here by Kaminga. Coming in with the basketball, get it off to Chris Paul. And it's 101 to 89 as Clay Thompson lays it up and in. Suns are closing in. Lakers are closing in on 10th place in the West. Such a big basketball game for a game for them to come out flat. Dealer with the basketball, wanted a foul, barely grazed the iron. Three is good, 104 89. Darvin Ham still ain't taking a timeout. Prince heaves up a three. No good. You can, number one, the fact that Anthony Davis isn't playing killed the Lakers. You can place this loss squarely on Darvin Ham. This game was 90-84, to 84, and Darvin Ham put a lineup out there of Dinwiddie, Gabe Vincent, Torian Prince, D'Lo, and Jackson Hayes. And that lead went from 90-84 to 84 to 106-89. to 89, And the Lakers don't even try to get off a shot in the third quarter. So, Lakers about to fall into 10th. And the Lakers are going to have to... Uh, win two games on the road to get into the postseason. And I'll be honest, you never know what Laker team you're going to get. So an incredibly disappointing performance tonight. So much on the line in this game for them to come out and just not have it. Not have it. And they didn't have it. The so Lakers were red hot. And now, you know, winning games and everything. And now not. Now not. So, Lakers are going to go into the postseason ice cold. And they better hope that they get their guys back because it's obvious. If this team doesn't have Anthony Davis, they really don't have a chance to beat any kind of competitive team. They just don't. They just don't. But I will say this. If there's a silver lining to the Lakers getting knocked out in the first, you know, in the play-in, Darvin Ham will be fired. If there is, I think that that would be a silver lining. They definitely need Vando. I don't know if, I don't know if Vando is coming back this year. But that, that lineup that they just had out there, I don't understand it at all. But it is what it is. The Lakers are the Giants of basketball. I wouldn't go that far. The Lakers make the playoffs. The Giants don't even make the playoffs. So, I don't know. I don't know.
don't know. I don't know. I don't know. But it is. Yo! the We're getting ready to buy the Sports Fury. What up? Listen. The Sports Fury. My guys over there. My inspiration for doing what I do. Always. We got three of them back there. We got Roach over there, who's a big Warrior fan. Always. Got my guy, uh, Josh. And, of course, Sean has made a comeback as well over there. Those guys are great guys. Appreciate the raid. You guys are the freaking best. Like I said, they're the best to do it. The first to do it. The biggest to do it. I wouldn't do what I do without those guys at the sports room. So I always appreciate them. Like I said, those guys are my inspiration. They do a lot of live streams. Obviously, they're a warrior. They they do a lot of warrior stuff. They also do other games. They do they did the college basketball stuff. They do baseball. Go check them out for sure. Like I said, those guys are my inspiration. And uh, actually, they're the inspiration for a lot of me. A lot of us wouldn't do, I shouldn't say a lot of us, most of us would not live stream if it wasn't for those guys. They're the first ones I ever saw do it. And I saw those guys doing their thing over there, and I said, shit, I got to get into this. I, I want to do this. And, um, yeah, without without those guys, I wouldn't be where I am. So always big respect to the Sports Fury. Um, wish this game was better. <laughs> <laughs> has not been good at all. But I appreciate the raid, fellas. Thank you so much. I don't have a beer, but Brilly Brilly, the Coke Zero is here. And the Lakers start the fourth quarter down by their largest deficit of the night. Tied up anyway, and Jackson A's with a dunk. LeBron back out there, and what do you know? Lakers get the first basket, 106-91. to Lakers had the game there. It was down to 90-84, and a 16-5 to run bumped that thing up to 17 again because the Lakers just do not play the defense. Lakers show by 15. Down the lane goes Kaminga, and he doesn't get the roll on that one. Rebounded by D'Lo. D'Angelo Russell bring it up into the front court. D'Lo back to LeBron. LeBron down the lane goes up and lays in with a little kiss. 106.93. I'm surprised Curry's not doing this. Uh, HM, thank you for the super chat, bro. Appreciate you. Thank you for being a I don't think they need a tank for Bronny. Bronny's not really that good. He's not going to be a lottery pick. I don't think the Lakers need to take him anyway. Offensive foul, so wipe away the basket. And I would have counted. 106-93. I don't think they need a tank for Bronny. And honestly, I think wherever Bronny goes, I think LeBron will follow him. I don't know. It is Ivan Alawi Macarvelli. Yes, it is. Austin Reeves down the lane goes up. Yes! And the foul. Give him over the arm. Austin Reeves will go to Lamedy over. And one. Leagues are the first six. Well, what do you know? Darvin Ham puts Reeves, LeBron. Oh, you put those guys back out there with D'Lo and you, you actually score? Reeves makes the free throw with the Clippers starting. <laughs> That's the wrong one. Wasn't paying attention. Pelicans are up by nine. Clippers are only up by 11. And a turnover for the Warriors. Boy, imagine if the damn Lakers didn't give up all those points at the end of the freaking third quarter. 106-96. Lakers have scored the first seven points of this quarter. They trail by 17. Reeves of the basketball at the top of the circle gave it off to LeBron James. LeBron James of the basketball, driving down the lane, spinning in the lane. LeBron turns, fades, fires, and he tickles the twine. I'm surprised Golden State hasn't taken a timeout. Lakers are the first nine points of the quarter. They trail by eight. And now they do call the timeout. Big shout out to BetUS, guys. BetUS, the best betting promotion going on the internet. On the internet. Anywhere, I should say. Obviously, they're on the internet. Click that link in the description under the promo code JOIN125. BetUS will give you a 125% match deposit bonus on your first three deposits of $100 or more, all the way up to a $2,500 
Bonus, you can do that three times to get $7,500 free money. That means by clicking that link and under the promo code Joe125, you deposit $500, BetUS will give you an extra $625 to play with. So you deposit $500, they give you eleven. you end up with $1,125 total. You can't miss out on this. You can bet on everything uh, at BetUS. Seriously, you can bet on anything you want. There's so many things, live betting, there's overseas basketball, there's horse racing, there's hockey, baseball, basketball, football, you can bet on the draft, you can bet on snooker, lacrosse, politics, however you do that. You can bet on anything. You can bet on cricket, you can bet on badminton, I don't know, you can bet on anything. You can bet on rugby, you don't want to miss out. I don't care where you bet, but you got to take advantage of this right now. And they're giving away $125 for free. The first five people that sign up at BetUS and enter that, pro- or click that link and enter the promo. The first five people that click that link, easy for me to say, you can tell I haven't done this in a week. And DM me on Twitter. Twitter's in the description. Instagram's in the description. DM me your account number. They're going to give you $25 to play with for free, for nothing. Terms and conditions apply, but you get a free $25 just for giving me your account number. I don't need your name. I don't need anything else. I don't need your password. I don't need your address. Just need your account number. I send that to BetUS. You get $25 to play with for nothing, for signing up. Take advantage of it. It's there. Do it. Do it. Great customer service. Pay us within 24 hours. Take care. Brush your hair. Make sure you sign up at BetUS. Hit that thumbs up. We'll do this Bet US, America's favorite sports book and casino. Live betting and race book. We're celebrating 30 years with a historic offer. A 125% sign-up bonus on your first three deposits. Plus 10% gambler's insurance. Get started today. Bet US, where the game begins. And I forgot to mention you get 10% gambler's insurance and all your net losses as long as you stay active every six months. Bet US, baby. Um... It is a good deal, R squared. It is. You're not going to get a better deal than that. Should I take three dollars cash out my ten dollar bet Laker money line? You might as well ride it out now. <laughs> might as well ride it out now. See if they can get a little bit closer. See if they get a little closer. Will Ham be fired? I don't know. We got to get these likes up here, though, man. We had like a thousand at the half. We have twelve hundred twenty nine right now. We got to get these likes up here. We got to get them up there. Got to get them up there. Uh, they are missing AD. Yeah, the, yeah, Star Dream. They go, if um, LeBron goes out, man, they, they struggle. Here in Atlanta, they accept about the possible trade for two. Who is... Uh, uh, we got back to action. The Warriors make another three. It's 109 to 98. I don't know who that is. I don't know who that is. What's going on, Asia, my lady? How are you? Always good to see you. Hope you're doing well. Lakers trail by 11. Lakers just can't get a stop. And they need LeBron James bangs into Chris Paul, goes down the lane, goes up. And he, how is LeBron not foul? I mean, LeBron got hammered and no foul call. He lays it up and in, does his shoulder thing, but he didn't. He's stretching his shoulders out. But he didn't get the foul 109 to 100. Lakers trail by nine. Curry throws it out to Draymond. Draymond with a bad pass. Stolen away by LeBron James. LeBron running down the court. Kicks it out to Vincent in the corner for three. And Gabe Vincent almost throws up an air ball. And the rebound grab there by Kamega. Why is Gabe Vincent getting these minutes? Can somebody tell me why Gabe Vincent is getting the minutes? And Max Christie is not. Another wide open three. Another three is good. 112 to 100. It's just... Um, it's just practice for the Warriors as there's been very little challenging on three-point shots tonight, which is why they're shooting 60% from downtown. LeBron James down the lane throws it to Jackson Hayes. Hayes goes up, and Hayes with an offensive foul turnover Los Angeles. Lakers really missing out on an opportunity tonight, man. Even if the other day, we even well remember the the Thunder law or the, I'm sorry the Kings lost the Lakers would have moved into eighth. More importantly, they would have distanced themselves from Golden State, and pretty much at least at the very worst, uh, would have assumed you know, would have uh, 
gave themselves ninth, which means they would have had the first game would have been at home. There's another basket by the Warriors. So now the Lakers are going to move to 10th, and they're going to have to win two road games, and they're not a good road team. So they're going to have to win two road games just to get into the postseason. It could be a short one for the Lakers this time around. 114-100 Golden State by two. Rui knocks it down with the free throw line, 114-102. No defense for the Lakers tonight at all. No Anthony Davis. That defense struggles. The energy without Anthony Davis out there is terrible by Los Angeles. It has been that way all year. When that guy's not out there, you can definitely tell the difference in the way they play. Chris Paul in the lane. Easy layup. 116-102. There is no energy. The energy level is so different when he's out there. And it is bad when he's not. LeBron goes up, draws the foul, and he'll go to the line for two. Lakers shell by 14. And it just is what it is. They would have they would be better with Caruso because Caruso was a uh Caruso is a good defender, but the Lakers really don't have their best defender is not around. I mean, both of their defenders out. There's no Jared Vanderbilt. I mean, they really miss Jared Vanderbilt. We have a time out of the floor. Uh, 721 to go in the fourth. Uh, let's repay. Let's repay those guys. Let me go here. Let me, let me pick this up here all in one second. Let's do this. Let's repay these guys. Let's give them a raid. Let's raid my guys over here. Where are we? What do I want? I want this guy. I want this. All righty. Let's repay the sports for you guys, girls. I'm going to drop the link in the description. I'm going to drop the link in the chat. You guys go over there. Say bad dog raid. I don't care. Bad dog, bad dog raid, whatever. Let's repay these guys. Go over raid my guys at Sports Radio. Like I said, they're my inspiration for doing what I do. I wouldn't do it without them. So go over there. Raid them up. Say bad dog raid, bad dog. Say whatever. Lake show, I don't care. We suck tonight, but it is what it is. But go over there. Click that link. And raid them up. Say bad dogs in the house, whatever. Let's go. Let's go. There we go. Hey, guys. Come on. Where's the raid at? Click that link, baby. There we go. There we go. Click it up. Give him a like. There you go. Thank you, guys. Yes, raid him up. Yep, those are my guys, man. Like I said, I wouldn't do it without the sports tree. Definitely not. Let's go. All right, thank you guys for the raid. Appreciate it. Let's get 1,300 likes in here. Come on. I got to be honest. I know people are saying Anthony Davis is soft. I don't know if you guys have ever had a migraine. They're, it, it's more than a headache. That's not... So, listen, I'm not trying to make excuses for Anthony Davis, Okay. But a migraine is not just take a couple of Advil and play through it. Migraines are are tough. They're tough to deal with. It just sucks. Yeah, it would have been nice, uh, but it does. You it causes dizziness. You can't see. It blurs your vision. It makes you nauseous. Like they're no joke. Like it's 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 not just a headache. A migraine is something completely different. 
LeBron uh, makes the free throw. It's made of both free throws. Sorry about that. It is 116 to 104. LeBron's had a good night tonight, but unfortunately, nobody's really stepped up. We haven't heard much from D'Lo, not much from Austin Reeves in this half. Lakers need some kind of defense, and they haven't been able to get it all night. There's an R3, and that's good by Wiggins, 119-104. They just, Lakers have played no defense. A very, very lazy defense tonight. 119-104, Golden State by 15. LeBron gives it out to D'Lo. Again, just look at the Lakers just standing around, watching, no ball movement, no moving without the basketball. Rui for three, throws up what almost was an air ball. Rebound there by Chris Paul. This and It's just not good. Chris Paul throws it away. Thought Wiggins was going to continue into the corner, and he did not. But that the, the defense, and again, just watching these, Warriors made 23 threes tonight, tying a season high. So that just tells you where it's been. Rui, from a foot away, leaves it short, missed a wide open layup, and foul the other way. And Dray- Draymond Green will go to the line. Uh, it's just too bad, man. They really, really missed Anthony Davis. I feel like the Warriors I feel like the Warriors getting one and a half was easy money. Or Warriors being a one and a half point favorite. That was easy money. I would have never taken the Lakers in this game. So Lakers unable to take advantage of the Suns losing, the Kings losing. Draymond missed them both. Pelicans are now up by 19, so Lakers are Lakers aren't going to get the sixth now. Uh, they needed to keep pace to the Pelicans, and they will mathematically be eliminated from sixth. Deal over three, no good, not close. Reeves chases it down in the corner. Reeves against Curry. Reeves of the basketball goes around a screen. Reeves is fouled. Gabe's the worst player to Lakers. I don't know why Gabe Vincent's getting the. I don't know why Gabe Vincent's getting the minutes. Hit that thumbs up. Let's get 1,300 likes. We'll do this again. Lakers have two games after this one of the regular season. We might only have three games left together this year. Obviously, if the Lakers lose in the first round of the play in, they are done, and they'll probably be taking on the Warriors. Rui kicks it back outside. Didn't win for three, and didn't when he can't get it to go. Lakers came out with bad energy right from the get-go. Warriors made about 70% of their threes. Lakers got off to a 30% start. LeBron dribbled it off his foot out of bounds. Actually, we'll stay with the Lakers. Josh TV went up. Cancun, there you go. Very, well, listen, if they don't, Cancun very soon if they don't figure out a way. LeBron James of the basketball. Well, Laker fans, I understand your frustration. Trust me when I tell you, man. I'm not even a Laker fan and I'm frustrated, so I get it. D'Lo for three. <sighs> Another miss. And just nothing went right in this game. They were They were beat from the very beginning. Anthony, thank you for the super chat, bro. Appreciate you. Brilly, brilly, my friend. There's another wide open three for Paul and throws up an air ball. Thank you for being afraid. LeBron James. What happened there? LeBron James laid it in. Was there a foul? And then he says the Lakers are tanking this game and the next two, I can see why. Because they don't want to face the Nuggets in the first round and they think the 8 or 9 is safer. But if the Nuggets end up in first, the Lakers are going to have... The Lakers are going to have to play them. The thing is, man, you don't... You don't want to chance it. You know what I mean? You don't, you don't want to chance... 
You don't have a chance because you'd have to win, you have to win two play-in games at this point. The Nuggets and the Timberwolves are tied at 55 and 24, so you don't even know. The Nuggets can finish second. I mean, I'm sorry, the Nuggets can win and the Lakers get the eighth seed. The winner, the, the team that's 9 10, okay, whatever, at the best, they're going to finish the eighth seed. If the 9 or 10 seed wins both of their games, they're the eighth seed. They play the number one seed. If you are the 7th and 8th seed, if you win, you're the 7th seed. If you lose and then win, you're the 8th seed. So, the winner of that second play-in game is the 8th seed. Will Farrell's there. Obviously, Laker fans not happy. But I, I, I get it, man. It's was not a good, not a good night for the Lakers. At all. Now the Lakers do have a Grizzlies team that's twenty seven and fifty two on deck. They better be able to beat them. They better be able to beat them. But Bronny scoring five points in the best day. What is he doing? <laughs> yeah. The refs are a joke. You need sleep, Gwendolyn? Yeah, I do too. It's been a long day, man. I was up at four thirty in the morning to catch my flight back to New York today so oh this game's not rigged by the officials guys the board is just better tonight i mean i'm not gonna i don't understand i don't understand why draymond did not get teed up but this one's not on the officials the warriors are just better tonight that's really all really all it was they shot better they played better lakers shot like crap lakers energy was bad warriors the warriors came out determined to win this game the warriors Wanted the game more. That's just the way I look at it. Now there's still 434 to go. I mean, there's time. You know, we've seen the Lakers have these spurts where they go on a 10 to nothing run. Um, but too many threes. I mean, the Warriors just made a shitload of threes. They've tied their season high. They made 23 threes. On like probably 40, you know, whatever. 40 attempts. Here's another wide open three. This one by Pitt, and it's good. I mean, the Lakers just don't... Lakers don't play any defense. Lakers are over five in this quarter. The Warriors, the Warriors shot 60%, made 24 threes. You're not going to win any games if you play that kind of defense. It's not going to happen. Reeves gives it out to Dinwiddie, who had the ball deflected out of bounds. That's all it was. The Lakers got to come back and have to beat the... Yeah, they, it doesn't really matter at this point. The Lakers kind of had to win this game, I feel like, to get to the eighth seed at least. And they didn't do that. 420 to go in the fourth quarter. By 420 to go fourth quarter. 420 green. You know what to do? Smoke weed. got him. Smoke weed every day. Rui lays it in. 122 to 108. So Lakers have to win two playing games. That's really the way it goes. They're gonna have. They're probably gonna play the Warriors, I would imagine again. And this time they'll play in Golden State as Clay makes it another wide open shot, one twenty four to one hundred eight. Um, but I, I can see that happening. So, and Rui had it blocked by Draymond. Might as well get your starters out of there, uh, Darvin Ham. They're giving Gary Payton a wide open three. He missed it. Like, Payton was sitting there thinking about it all night. Nobody ran at him. Warriors with the... I'm sorry. Reeves down the lane, goes up, makes a shot, 124-110. Just bookkeeping at this point. Yeah, another blowout. This seems to be the case. The Lakers will drop the 2-4 and four without Anthony Davis. And again, the margin of defeat has been blowouts Every game, Draymond over three. Why not? Wow, truth. That's the Draymond I know. Missed the rim completely. That's the Draymond Green I know from downtown. LeBron finds Rui. Wow, they just... Gary Payton just bodied Rui to the ground, and they did not call a foul. Unbelievable.
Look at look at that. Tell me that's not a block. Tell or tell me this isn't a foul. Gary Payton has his hand on Rui's back, pushes him in the back with one hand, clobbers him with the other. No foul call. No foul call. That was an absolute foul. I don't care what the score is. You can't push a guy in the back and then block his whole arm, hit Rui's arm going to the basket. <laughs> That's a foul. That was a foul. I don't care what the score was. That was a foul. That was a foul. Well, like I said, the Lakers, it doesn't really matter. They're they're going to be ninth or 10th now, so they're going to have to win two playing games, and it has not been easy. I am hopeful that the Lakers can continue their season, um, but at this juncture, it's going to be tough. Uh, hit that like, subscribing the bell, guys and girls. Let's go. Appreciate you being here. LeBron's still in there. I don't know why. LeBron makes the layup. Whoops, I lost my chat. I lost my chat. Give my chat back. There we go. Another three for the Warriors. Why not? 131-12. This looks like the All-Star game, honestly. Just no defense for the Lakers. The Warriors are 26 for 41 from downtown. 63%. That team shot 63% from downtown in this game. That just tells you the lack of defense by the Lakers. But I can tell you this. If, if the Lakers and Warriors do meet up in the playing round, the Warriors will never shoot threes like that again. They won't. Francis, I don't even know. If, I don't even know if Vando would have helped in this game. The Lakers' defense was so bad. The Warriors just shot the ball incredibly well. I don't think I've ever seen a team make twenty six threes and shoot sixty three percent while doing it. I don't think so. I don't think so. But again, just a very disappointing night for Los Angeles. They were never really in this game. They never were. Their energy at the beginning of this game was very poor. Right from the start, it was bad. It looked bad. They started 0 for 6. Draymond Green knocked down his first five threes. The Warriors were 7 out of 10. The Lakers never recovered. Darvin Ham. Uh, like I said, man, the war, um, silver lining in a bad Lakers season, Darvin Ham should be fired. And I think he will be. I think he will be. So you'll have that going for you next year. And it'll be interesting to see exactly what they do. Um, Kyrie missed the eclipse because the moon doesn't really <laughs> right. He thinks the earth is flat. Yeah, yeah, exactly. <laughs> um. So, we'll see. I mean, LeBron is a $51 million player option. I can't see LeBron turning down $51 million, no matter how much money he has. So, I think LeBron will be back next year, and the Davis obviously will be back. I don't think Darvin Ham will be. Um, and I also think that Rob Palenka should lose his job. I think Rob Palenka should lose his job as well. I think the Lakers, with the amount of talent that they have, and for the most part, LeBron James and Anthony Davis being healthy for a lot of the year, um, 
I, the fact that they play so poorly and they underachieve almost every year, I think Palinka needs to lose his job. I really do. I think Palinka needs to lose his job. He's done a bad job since that championship. He's done nothing but kind of tear down the Lakers. They they've been a they've been a playing team every year since then. One year they missed the playoffs completely, but this team is not. They never even make the playoffs. They're obvi- They're seventh or eighth. This year they're probably going to be tenth. They're not a good. I mean, they're not good enough. Polinka has a lot to do with that. Polinka is the one that puts these players out there. Blink is the one that hires the head coach. So, why Max Christie didn't get more of a run tonight, I don't know. Reddish misses a three. Why Reddish is even a part of this team? There's a reason you're on six on four teams in six years. Yeah, LeBron and AD pretty much like with swords. They have been healthy a lot of the year. How many people LeBron got fired? I mean, I don't know. He didn't get Spolstra fired. Spolstra was there. Spolstra's still there. Um, I mean, he did win a championship with Frank Vogel. I think Palinka. I think Palinka got him fired because he he got rid of he got rid of all of his bigs. He signed, you know, he traded for Russell Westbrook. He gave up all of his gave up all of his draft picks and ended up with a really crappy team. Brought in guys like Trevor Ariza and and Kent Bazemore, and they they were a bad team. Palinka did that to Vogel. Vogel won a championship. Palinka did that. You know, I just, I don't know. Palinka, does, Palinka doesn't believe in getting defenders. You look at the Knicks, the Knicks win with defense, right? That's what the Knicks do. Defense still wins in this league. I know it's become a three-point league, but defense still wins. That's why three and D guys are so important because you want guys that can defend the perimeter and make the three. The Lakers really don't have those guys. Jared Vanderbilt is a really good defender. He's their best on-ball defender, no question about it. He's not a three-point shooter, though. Lakers really don't have a 3 and D guy. Cam Reddish is supposedly a good defender, but all I see is a guy out there running laps, getting cardio. He doesn't contribute on any either side of the floor. So, I don't know. Lakers are going to... Lakers are going to uh, finish their season on their home court with a loss. They will play the they're going to play the Grizzlies Friday. I'd imagine the Stars will play now, depending on where they are on Sunday. As far as the standings go, they may sit everybody at that point. And get ready for the playoffs. There's Colin Castleton. Castleton with a dunk. Oh, again, it's just bookkeeping. That's going to be the final score, 134 to 120. Um, Cheddar, I'd have no fear. I mean, I've said this before. You know this. Even when the Lakers get knocked out of the postseason, I still cover the NBA playoffs, and that will be the team that I concentrate on because I always do the Western Conference because, again, it just lines up with my schedule better. But they will be... That will be the team that I concentrate on if the Lakers get knocked out. Will be the Clippers. That will be the team. I still do other games. And depending on, you know, what's going on, like my schedule, I may be able to do a Knicks game, which would be nice, but the Knicks always play early, which kind of kills me. But um, the Clippers will be the team that I cover. More. And it's just a shame because, again, you look at the Suns are about to lose. The Lakers could have jumped the Kings. They would have been one half game. They just failed to take advantage. They had a really good opportunity, and they, unfortunately, they just couldn't get it done tonight. The Warriors are just, I mean, you just never seen a, you never seen a team. I haven't seen a team shoot like that. 26 threes, 63% from downtown. Draymond Green is a dad. That actually worries me with how violent that guy is. I can't believe somebody lives with that guy. With how violent and psychotic Draymond Green is. I don't know. 
Uh, it sucks that this game was so shitty, but it was nice to get back. And like I said, I've been on vacation the last week. I missed the last three Laker games. Um, but it is good to be back doing Laker games. I don't know how many more we got. We got at least three, uh, but that might be it. Hopefully not. Hopefully the Lakers find a way to get their shit together. And again, I feel like they're going to play the Warriors in the first round. It's just going to depend on if the Lakers have the home court advantage or the Warriors do. And hopefully the Lakers can get healthy and they have Jared Vanderbilt and they have Anthony Davis and they have LeBron James and and those guys can make a run. I remember, you know, the year that they played the Suns. They just started out that year 21-6. It was the year after their championship run. And both Davis and LeBron missed a lot of time. The Lakers ended up in the play-in. And they played the Warriors, which is my all-time biggest viewed stream. And the, um, you know, then they played the Suns. They were up two games to one. And they were right in that game at halftime in game four. And then Anthony Davis got hurt and they never recovered. And Anthony Davis stayed healthy against the Suns. I have no doubt the Lakers would have won that series. But it's kind of gone downhill since. And last year they made a miracle run to the Western Conference Finals. And again, if the Lakers are that kind of team, they're just a Jekyll and Hyde kind of team. They can be really good. They can be really bad. They're the girl with the curl. We've seen this within games, not just one game to the next. We have seen this team literally go up by 18 against the Kings, get blown out. Like that is, that's the Lakers. They can be really, really good. They can be really, really bad. But this team... This team does not play with the same energy uh, without Anthony Davis on the court. There's just something about He has been the Lakers' best player this whole year. They feed off his energy. So, you know, he's got a couple days to recover. I'm sure that he and LeBron will both play against the Grizzlies. Um, Lakers have got to win the next two games. You know, they got to find a way. You want to get at least ninth. You don't want to have to win back-to-back road games in order to just get the eighth seed and probably take on the Nuggets. Do you miss somebody? To- I'll be honest with Swords. I-, I don't know. Even the Laker offense, I mean, they scored 100. And, well, I mean, they pretty much scored 112 when the game was competitive. But the Warriors are 26 out of 41 from downtown. 63%. They shot 60% of the field. Lakers shot 45% of the field, 34% from three. Just not good. LeBron had 33, 11, and seven. Rui ended up with 20 and 11. Jackson Hayes, 11 and six. Reeves is 22, seven and six. D'Lo just three out of 11. But the Laker bench outside of Dinwiddie, who was four for seven with 12 points. Torian Prince had two points. Cam Reddish, 10 minutes, nothing. Gabe Vincent, 15 minutes for Gabe Vincent. Over three from downtown. No points. Outside of Spencer Dinwiddie, the only guy that actually scored when it mattered off the bench was Torian Prince. He had two points because the other bench points, Maxwell Lewis, Colin Castle, and Max Christie, that was in garbage time. So outside of Dinwiddie, the Laker bench had two points. That ain't going to get it done. That ain't going to get it done. You know, that's not going to get it done at all. Draymond Green had 15 points in the first half. That's what he finished with. But it is what it is. I went one for two, by the way. I had Clay Clay Thompson on my bet. He had, what was it, 24 and a half. He had 30. I did not get Trace Jackson's. He only had seven and seven. I thought he would do better. So I went one for two on my betting tonight. So I broke about even, which I've been breaking even pretty much all year uh, with basketball. But... Again, just a, a disappointing... The Warriors are just 14 out of 21 from the free throw line, too. It's just a disappointing night. Lakers, again, that energy wasn't there. When the Lakers are playing at their best, they really depend on teams to miss shots. That's what they do. Lakers are able to run when teams miss shots. When teams are making their shots, they don't... You know, it doesn't happen that way. They just they are not the same team when teams are making shots. So... When the Warriors are making their shots, it makes the Lakers. It makes it difficult for the Lakers to get out and run um, with the basketball. So Lakers now are 
Um, that hasn't updated. But the Lakers are 45 and 35. The Warriors are 44 and 35. So obviously the Warriors have another game to play. They own the tiebreaker. So it means if they finish with the same record as the Lakers, um, they will have the ninth seed. The Lakers get the 10th. And the Lakers will have to win back to back road games. It is true, uh, Liquid Swords, that they, the in season tournament, um, that Laker team during that tournament run played the best basketball of the year. They were 14-9 and nine at that point. It looked like they were really going to begin to take off, and then they lost a ton of games. They got blown out by the Fal- the Falcons. They got blown out by the Hawks. They got blown out by the Rockets. Like the- And this is before the Rockets were playing good basketball. The Lakers are just, you don't know what you're going to get from one night to the next. You don't know. You get a really good game. That's why the play-ins are very dangerous. Because when it's single elimination, if you're ninth or 10th, the Lakers could come out and they could blow the Warriors out the way the Warriors blew them out tonight or vice versa. Lakers could win a game by 18 points and they could lose a game by 18 points. You just don't know what Laker team you're getting. You don't know. So... Again, the Lakers' goal is to get healthy, get as many guys as they can, get Van, get Vando back, get Anthony Davis back, get LeBron James healthy, and do the best you can do and, and hope the next time you meet the Warriors, they don't shoot 63% <laughs> and make 26 threes. Just in, insane. Um, listen, I, a lot of Laker fans don't like LeBron. And I, I understand LeBron is a very polarizing figure. Uh, underst- I understand. Um, but, you know, they did win a championship with him here. So it is what it is. But, we'll, I mean, I don't know what the future holds for LeBron James. What I do know is the Lakers' future, they're going to have to – they're just going to play really good basketball. We've seen them play really good basketball. We've seen them beat the Celtics without the two best players. We've seen them go into Madison Square Garden and beat the Knicks. We've seen them beat the Timberwolves. We've seen them beat the Thunder. We've seen them beat a lot of good teams. We've seen them lose to a lot of bad teams. You just, like I said, you just don't know what you're getting from one game to the next. What I do know is they play the Grizzlies on Friday. They've got to win that game. they got to win. They've got to win that game. No question about it. There's no excuses. The Grizzlies are a terrible team. They're 27-52. and 52. They're just playing out the season. They got nothing to play for. Go out there and win that game. And then you got the Pelicans. The Pelicans might have nothing to play for. They may be locked in a sixth at that point. And maybe you get their backups and you can... You got to have the Warriors lose a game. I don't know what the Warriors schedule looks like. This was a really... This one really, really hurts, man. This really hurts. That it hurts. That that is a that's a tough loss for the Lakers. The Warriors have the Trailblazers tomorrow. That's a win. Then they play the Pelicans on Friday, and the Jazz on Sunday. So two very easy games for the Warriors. The Pelicans game will be tough. Which is even more important why the Lakers needed to win this game. So, the Lakers need the Warriors to lose somewhere. And the Lakers have got to win the last two games of the season. They do. But that was that was tough. Tough loss for them tonight. Yep, Lakers got the Grizzlies and the Pelicans. So I'll be live 745 Friday night in New York, 445 p.m. Friday in Los Angeles, 745 Saturday morning. The Philippines will all be celebrating the weekend together, and hopefully the Lakers can find a way to win. It was good to be back. I missed you guys without question. Appreciate you all hanging out tonight without question. Wish the game was better. I always hate blowouts. You know that. I don't like blowouts. So the Lakers are going to lose Give me a thrilling game. Give me a back and forth game. Give me one that goes down to the wire. Don't give me one that's pretty much over at halftime. The, you know, I I said early in this game when the Lakers went down 17, the second quarter game was over. They're just their body language sucked, and we've seen that a few times this year, especially at the beginning of the year, where their body language is just ass. 
I, I just hope this team doesn't feel like you can just turn it on anytime you want to and it's going to be there. Because some nights, teams like the Warriors are going to have these ridiculous shooting nights, which is what happened tonight. Um, but anyway, remember, I'll be live for the Yankees tomorrow. The Yankees are a good team, and I always love calling baseball games. It'll be a much smaller crowd, but I would love you guys and girls to um, hang out. You know, for the Yankees and the Marlins, I'll be live for that. I think they play at 7.05. So, let me go Let me go to my little appy here. <laughs> so, we'll have like 10 minutes before the game for my Yankee fans out there. Yes, tomorrow 7.05. So, I'll be live at probably like 6.55, uh, somewhere in there. You gotta beat the Marlins. The Marlins are one and eleven tomorrow. Is Marcus Stroman against uh, whoever Weathers is, and um, yeah, so I'll do that and hopefully get a better result. And then we'll be live for the Lakers on Friday. So sorry, guys and girls, that this game sucked, but hopefully Friday games is much better. Uh, once again, the final score of the night: Golden State Warriors win handily, one thirty-four to one twenty. For the love of the Ivan Lowry, it's your boy, the Bad Digging Dizzle. Enjoy the rest of your Tuesday or Wednesday, everybody. And I'll see you tomorrow for the Yankees and Friday for the Lakers. And we out.